I updated her wardrobe a little bit, so I'm going to show you all. So I gave her this outfit and it's yellow, so I hope you're all happy. And then I gave her a new sleepwear outfit. And then I think I gave her a new hot weather outfit. This uh, yellow and white dress I feel like is really perfect for this generation. And then I gave her like a little tracksuit moment for her cold weather. So yeah, that's all. That's all I updated. Is she pregnant? Yes, she's pregnant. And we're going to build a house for them today. So here we go. Are you ready? Um, so when it comes to moving, I'm going to put all of the stuff I want to keep in our family inventory. And then I'm just going to delete everything else. I guess this I can sell. That's Harvest Fest stuff. But we need to keep our um, plants for sure. Our sprinkler, our bicycle, our cow plants, camera. I don't know if I'm going to keep the dumpster or not. Telescope. Um, and then anything from in here that we want to keep, like our family photos and stuff. Definitely want to keep those. Basically stuff that I can't easily just replace. Like everything else, it doesn't matter. I'm not putting a budget on us if you missed that because we won the lottery. So uh, we don't need to worry about a budget. Okay, our sim capsule things. Maybe that. Also, Crow, thank you for the 17 months. I really appreciate it. Welcome back. Um, Anything else? unforgettable that I don't want to lose I guess that <laughs> I think everything else we can just delete and bulldoze and rebuild so so yeah are you ready it's time to move in the middle of the night hello everyone um <coughs> sorry move household I already got the uh, the picture frames. Oh, you're talking about the picture frames from the pack. Yeah, I'm excited about those. Best time to move. Yeah, it's just like literally the middle of the night. So um, we have a child, we have a toddler, and we're pregnant. So we're going to be building a house to accommodate for all of that. And I think I want to build here on this 23 eucalyptus lane. I'm going to sell furniture. I'm going to bulldoze the lot. So yeah. Really hoping the next baby is a boy. I'm a trans guy and it's rare to see male heirs. It is really rare to see male heirs. Um, okay. Here we go. We already do have two, two boys though. So secretly I'm hoping for a girl. Oh dang, this lighting is not good. To be building in. It's literally raining. Oh no, unlucky. Um, what the heck is all this stuff? Oh, is this like burnt furniture that I found? I guess I'll just get rid of all of this. Wow. Okay. I guess I went dumpster diving a lot. It doesn't matter. I'm not, I'm not limiting ourselves to a budget. Um, I cleared my schedule for the rest of my day so I could watch you build. No way. Did you really? I have to take my son to a birthday party in an hour? Like IRL or in The Sims? Until it's morning again? Um, I think morning is still very terrible. I'm in the afternoon because this is the brightest. So, okay. I don't know exactly what kind of house I'm going to go for here. So I think I'm just going to build and see what happens. Sound like a plan? Why? Smiling face with hearts. Aww. Thank you for the resub, Keteg. It's good to see you. Welcome back. I think I want to have like a yard over here and maybe build the house over here. So we're going to need a bedroom for the parents. I want to have each of the kids in their own bedrooms. So three bedrooms unless we have twins. 
And then maybe a guest room just in case people want to come stay over with us. So we should try for four bedrooms, maybe. Room for a greenhouse. Yeah, I also have to, with the Sims in Bloom challenge, let me open up the rules really quick. Sims in Bloom. Just so we know. Um, I also need to make sure I have room for my cow plants. A greenhouse so I can grow five perfect plants. And also it talks about having fruit trees that we're growing and we like to do yoga under them. So I'm going to try to do that as well. If we're not able to do fruit trees, then I will just have a tree that we do yoga under. Um, yeah, we definitely we definitely need room for a garden. I feel like is very important for us. So yeah. Um, also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. I hope the cow plant won't glitch. Oh, yeah, it might glitch. If it glitches, that's totally okay, though. That's okay. I'm not too worried about it. All right, I always like to start with, like, a box and then go from there. So, here we go. I think I would like to have, like, kind of a uh, front porch, potentially. This is really close to the edge of the lot. I did pick kind of a tiny lot now that I'm looking at it. Let me just uh, move everything back a little bit. Whoa. There we go. We'll figure it out. Yoga on the treehouse. Oh, true. Can you put a yoga mat up on the treehouse? I don't. I haven't played with the treehouse yet, so I'm unaware if that's a thing. I am unaware. Okay. Um, probably do something like this. We can have a nice roof here. I'm probably gonna be just messing around with the shape of this house for a little bit. Uh, just a warning, because <laughs> I. I feel like I'm really bad at picturing a house before it's built. So I apologize in advance for how much um, messing around I'm going to be doing here. Like, I'm not the, the greatest at that. Does anyone have problems with UI cheats? Uh, no, not since I've updated it. I haven't had any issues with it. Are you using the most updated version of UI cheats? You're using one of my homes right now? No way. Are you really? I hope you're having a great time with it. That's exciting. I've got issues with UI cheats. Oh no, what are the UI cheats issues you all are having? That doesn't sound good. Ugh, my nose is so itchy today. I feel like this is really cute. Like, is this is this not a fun shape? I feel like this is kind of a fun shape for a for the front of a house. Something like that, maybe. What challenge am I playing? I'm playing Sims in Bloom right now. The first episode is now up on my YouTube channel, so if you missed that. Um, definitely, definitely go get caught up so that way you know what's going on. Uh, the first episode is split into two parts. So part two, I just posted today. So if you've been waiting for that, it is up and it is ready to go. I feel like we can do a chimney here, maybe. That's a bit tall. Maybe a little bit shorter. Hi, ladybugs. How are you? Yeah, there's probably quite a few glitches, but I haven't had any issues with the mods since they've been updated. So uh, if you're having any weird glitches, definitely like double check that your mods are actually updated. That would be my first suggestion. Two and a half years. Wow, time goes by so quick. Happy to have found Aww, your Andrew. Love. I can't believe it's been two and a half years as well. Thank you so much 
Uh, especially for the kind words. Thank you. Uh, it's been limited? Oh, I haven't noticed that. I don't know. I'm sorry y'all are having bugs, though. That's no fun. That is no fun at all, actually. I like the front of this house. I think this looks nice. What do you guys think? I think we can work with this. Um, yeah. She's cute. I love it. The only thing I'm upset about is I kind of wanted to use the new growing together window. This one. And I feel like if I want to use this window, maybe I have to get rid of this little bump out here. Which I could do. Like, we could just get rid of that. But I also, I don't know. I don't know if that feels right. Hmm. I know the triangle window is so good. I love it. I don't know. What do we think, chat? Oh, there's some taller ones. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. I didn't notice this. I feel like that's so much. You could put, oh, it could be a piece of roof or maybe planter boxes even. You know, that might be a vibe. Let me, let me look at a planter box here. We could probably do that. It's not a bad idea. Come on. I don't know, something like that maybe? Should I, should I sacrifice that bump out for these windows? I think so, maybe. The taller looks better. Well, do you see how it like clips with the roof here? Like, I don't want it to clip with the roof too much is the is the problem. So if I use the taller one, I would have to make this a medium wall height as well. And I don't know if I like how tall that is. Does that make sense? Also, Bonnell, thank you for the race up for one year. Yo, can we get some pride votes in the chat? Let's go. Wait, why does the white one not have any form of trim? No, that bothers me. That bothers me so deeply. I don't know. Is this the new world? Yes, it is. We're going to be living here. We got a new chimney, too. Well, that's exciting. I suppose I could use the new chimney. Like that. Yeah, this one is a taller one. This is a medium wall height already. Um, are there any doors that are medium wall height, though? No. Okay, so there's there's another issue we have to be aware of. Ooh. What are the vibes of this? What is this? I'm sorry, but... Does anyone like this door? I'm not trying to offend anyone, but maybe we go for a little bit more of these modern vibes here. I could go for the yellow because this is the daisy generation. It looks oddly short. Yeah, it feels very like awkwardly shaped. I don't know. I'm only thinking yellow because this is the daisy generation. Don't get any weird ideas, chat. I'm just trying to play the challenge better. Who is she? What did you do with Shella? <laughs> oh, no. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know how I feel about having another large window over here. I'd probably do something like this. Hmm. 
Is that weird? I feel like that's kind of fun, stacking a window like that. I don't know. I don't like yellow. I don't. I don't. I'm just thinking maybe we use yellow because this is the uh, yellow generation. So. Um, when is the new Not So Very video? It's going to be pushed back a little bit. I, ha I haven't recorded. I just haven't edited it yet. Because I'm more focused on my uh, new challenges that just came out. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a, a day or two. Sorry about that. Do I like how that looks? I can't tell. That's a nice shade of yellow to be fair. Yeah, it's not the worst. Like it, it definitely could be way worse. Okay, maybe let's finish the shape of the house too. I feel like I want a little bit of a bump out here. Just to have one. Um. Probably like that, maybe? And then... I'd probably do like a porch right here. So I'm thinking we do like this. I think that's nice. Um, can I upload Not So Berry Starter on the gallery? Yeah, I actually have uploaded all of my not so berry starters to the gallery already so you should be good they might be a little ways back though because it definitely was like a year ago that i started the challenge so you might have to do some searching I, i'm sorry about that oh i think that's nice i think that's nice what about a wraparound porch um i don't think i want to do a wraparound porch because i want there to be a large uh, backyard space so I think I'm going to just go with this shape. I don't really know if I want to add another bump out over here either. Do I think this is big enough for five bedrooms? Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I do need to add another little bump out of space. It's definitely a very nice sized home, but I feel like it could be bigger. A wrap around <laughs> side yard is the new backyard yeah i'm thinking a side yard would be really nice i might add another little maybe like this um I don't know if I like this. I'm just looking for a second. Well, I'm just looking. No, I don't think I do. Actually, I don't know. That, that kind of does look a little bit nice. Maybe if there was like one more space between these two. Like if I went like that instead. I'm getting really like really picky here, but you know, sometimes you gotta be picky when you're building a house. Especially since I have no limits. I better go all out. You got your first aggressive toddler. Oh my god. Has anyone else gotten um What's it called? The infants that are like really angry all the time because I haven't gotten one yet and I feel like I'm really lucky and I should be cherishing my peaceful moments while I can. Because that sounds terrible. I don't know if I want to deal with 
an angry toddler. Okay, yeah. I feel like this house feels really big now. And do this again. Um, also, thanks for the follow. Welcome on in. Ah. <sighs> I don't think I can handle Angie. Yeah, I haven't gotten an Angie one yet, so I'm a little scared. A little bit scared. Your first one is Calm. Yeah, I, I've gotten Calm ones too. So I feel like maybe I'm just lucky. I don't know. I think that's good. Why does that look? There we go. It looks so cool so far. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. I'm also really liking this house. I could do like stained glass here. That's like an interesting, I don't know. I don't know if I like that though. I'm not sure what kind of window to do here. I could also just not put a window here and instead do like a, maybe like a trellis or something. I haven't gotten the chance to play yet. It's killing me. Oh no. My toddler kicked the heck out of her uncle and then immediately demanded that he do flashcards with her. What a little brat. Oh my gosh. That's scary. Toddlers scare me. I'm not going to lie. Okay. I think that this house is definitely big enough for this growing family. And in fact, it's a very huge upgrade from what they had. So they should be grateful for this. Um, and I, I think I'm liking the vibe so far. Now, I feel like we should decide our color scheme on the outside here. Maybe. And I'm wondering if we use some of the new growing together stuff. Because this is like, a, it feels kind of modern. I don't know. White brick. Yeah, what if we use this as our base? Where did my... Are you for real? If I do this, it gets rid of the chimney. Okay, well, I'll do that last then. Uh, I don't know. Like, what are we thinking? It looks so yellow. Yeah, I really do like this stone. I also think this adds like some good texture to it. Dang, that is really yellow. I'm not sure about that. Um, yeah, I get that a lot too, Spags. I don't know what it means, that little pop up. I've been getting that every time I load into my lot and I'm like, okay. And. Yeah, I like this wood color. What if we do, what if we do like little wooden accents here? I think that's nice. And then should we try to add in like another texture too? I don't know. Honestly, I might like this stone more than I like. Huh. The other stone. I can't tell. You think it looks good? I think I might want to do this instead on the bottom. And then what if we try to do the wood kind of more on the top? Hold on. I haven't used these wallpapers yet, so this is kind of like a, a learning experience for me. 
see what I like to combine together. Let's just say we do the top all this wood color. Just for funsies to see if we like it. Yeah, I think I like the stone better for sure. Um, and now I'm wondering, like, do we want to add in some texture with this? Or is that, like, too much now? Do we need to, like, hold back? You like this combo? Okay, good. I'm, I'm liking it, too. I think it's kind of fun. Um, hi, Mystery. How are you? Hello, hello. I do kind of like having this as some more uh, texture, though. I think that's really nice. It's very wooden. But maybe that's good because our founder is really into, like, gardening and stuff. So maybe she's, like, she likes this vibe because the eco-friendly vibes, maybe. I don't know. It was bright yellow, but it worked so well. What? When I was trying the yellow stuff, you liked it? Oh, no. Not this. You can't make me. You can't make me. Um. Uh-oh. I'm not a fan of what's happening here. Hi, Ocean. Welcome in. I watched your new YouTube challenge and I love it. Really? Which one? Are you talking about the 100 baby challenge or my Sims in Bloom? Because right now we're building for Sims in Bloom. I'm going to have to add like, ooh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, that's nice. Wait, I could have like a dark brown kind of going around town. Do I like that, though? I can't tell. Maybe I did like it in this wood color. Um, I don't think I like it here. But I think I like it going around the other stone stuff. I think that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think, chat? Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. How are you today, Miv? It's good to see you. Oh, you watched both? Aw, oh, thanks, Mystery. I'm glad. That's illegal. What are you doing? What does a Mizzy oh, no. do? It gets jalapeno business. Oh my gosh. There's Brie, everyone. We were waiting for it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Is this for my Sims in Bloom challenge? Yes. This is my this is my little Sims in Bloom family. And this is my first time building with the uh with the new pack. So we're having a good time. I'm enjoying it. Ooh, maybe the red roof. Wait a minute. She's warm, she's inviting. She's comforting. Although, maybe if we just tone it down a little bit with, like, brown instead. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that. I think that's really good. I really like that. Okay. Sick. What do we think so far, you guys? Excuse me? Uh, also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. I still can't decide if I'm here for the yellow or not. Here's the problem, though. I don't like how these have no panes in them. But I do think that... It might look better if we don't have... What if I, what if I did this brown instead? I'm changing it all. I think that actually, I quite like that better. To me, that yellow screamed like 
This is a construction zone. I don't know why, but it was giving me like Bob the Builder energy and that's not what I want for my house, so. Yeah. This is not a Bob the Builder house. Uh, also, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Thank you. Well, you historically love the color yellow, so I can't imagine why you did not use it. Okay, Miv. Miv is sabotaging my stream. I do not think so, Mivyard. Not in this economy. Not in this economy. The brown looks, yes, I like brown. Okay. It's giving pencil and caution. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, watch out. That's the vibes I was getting, and that's not the vibes I want. Um, also, Sarah, thank you for the 14 month resub. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And then we can use these pillars here in the front. That look really good. Oh my god, my nose is itchy. The yellow was not Rochella yellow, wrong shade. Oh my god, you guys. Not the Rochella yellow. We could even do the stairs from Seasons. Huh? Those look pretty good. Hi, Nat. Welcome in. Your builds are incredible. Oh my gosh, what the heck? You're so nice. Thank you. The yellow's gone? Oh yeah, I... I deleted it. So sorry if that was your favorite part of the build. Um, she's dead. We decided to go with like a more wood vibe. And I'm honestly here for it. I think the wood vibe is here. Like, it's what we needed. Um, I'm gonna use... Where is she? Where is she? Where's my favorite... Hello? They added a new column to the game. Is this it? No, this is it. I'm gonna use this. Oh, is this not gonna let me, like, go all the way up because... Oh, no, it is. Why is it being... No, this is homophobic. There we go. Ooh, close one. Close one, you guys. Not be having that. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, everyone. Don't worry. I want to use this to, like, make these the shape of this house really pop. And it's going to pop to the top. Yeah, we're gonna pop, 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 pop to the top. It's gonna look really good. So we got a lot of interesting bevels. Very good. Oh my god, wait! This house kind of slays, you guys. It kind of looks really good. You're an interesting bevel. No, you're not. What? I started singing that when you did. Yes, we're in sync. Part of being one of my mods is also having the same brain as me, so I apologize to all of my mods. My brain is a scary place. Welcome. Join us, thrive. Um. Okay, let me quickly dingle dangle. Yippity do. Okay. Flippy tabby tuta. We did it. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Um, what world is this in? This is in the new one. Are those triangle windows new? Yes, these are from the, the pack. And I was like, ooh, we can use them now. So I'm excited. There's too much wood. Where's the splash of color? My friend. I'll show you a splash of color. Just you wait. As soon as I get my hands on the rest of this house, you're going to be blown away. But I must ask you one thing. Patience, my child. Patience. Because I'm going to add, like, plants and stuff. And it's going to be really, really cool. I think you'll like it. 
I don't ask for much. I just ask for a bit of faith, trust, undeniable love. That's cute. I like that. Um, I missed a wall near the front door. Um, no, you missed a wall near the front door. What are you talking about? I've never... I don't miss things, okay? <laughs> um... You want me to do the pillars a darker brown color on this one? What, like this? I could do that, but I kind of like how the contrast of the white makes it stand out a little bit more. I don't know. Oh my gosh, hi, welcome to Twitch, Milam. It's good to have you. You're all caught up on YouTube content. I think the white stands out a little bit more and I think I like that. I do agree though that this brown actually does match this house perfectly. But I think I want, cause if I don't have that, then I feel like these windows with the white around them will stand out too much and be a little confusing. So that's what I'm counting on. However, who am I to stop you from changing it if you actually want to, if you download this house? Honestly, when I say go for it change everything I do. It won't bother me one bit. That is so cute. Are you kidding me? I'm in love. I also want to put, um, since this house is going to be lived in by someone who's into gardening. Oh, wow. Everything's dead. That's exactly what I wanted. Um, I was going to put some of these like in the front <laughs> so it would look cute, but they're dead. So we're going to have to use our imaginations uh, to imagine what that will look like when they look nicer. Um, so sad. <laughs> and they're dead. Yeah, we got some color going on. We'll also do some like landscaping with the bushes in the front too. Put some more color in there. Um, also, thank you for the scritches for Olivia. Thank you so much. It'd be great if the columns had a shade like the dark brown. Um, yeah, it looks like they don't have that dark brown color. That sucks. But I do think I like this better than making these white. I think I like these being brown. I think I'm going to stick with that. Okay, um, before we figure out the rest of our windows, I'm going to figure out our floor plan. So let's get in there and let's figure this out. Again, keeping in mind, we're about to have another baby. So we already have two kids. We're about to have another one. Hopefully it's only one. And then we also need a bedroom for Petal and Everett. So we need like five bedrooms. Probably a couple bathrooms. Okay. I usually like to try to find the stairs first because the stairs are like the part of the house that you can't really change. So let me just do that. Um, in a house like this, I feel like they'd maybe be in the front entryway kind of. Um, so I'm thinking like maybe... What if I just had like a staircase right here? Cause I, what I could do is I could put like a wall here and have like a little archway that goes that way. So let's see about this. Just get them a pea bush. You don't want my Sims to have a nice, <laughs> a nice bathroom to use. Oh my gosh, you guys. Hi Rosie, how are we doing? Oh, I think we're doing pretty good. Chat, how are you doing? Personally, personally, I'm doing great. Um, okay, so we could do bedrooms, like one bedroom, two bedroom. Three bedroom. Uh, 
bedroom with bathroom maybe how how big is this let's let's put a bed in there and see what it looks like yeah it's a bit of a weird shaped room because it's really long but we could like i don't know we can make that work hi what's up i love cheese thank you okay love you too tony gave me butt cheese I feel like the room would make more sense if the bathroom was over here, but I really like th this big window and I don't want this big window to be a bathroom. So what do I do? Do I make this just like a nice aesthetic reading area? How many kids does this gen need? Uh, it doesn't have a kid requirement. So I think I'm gonna go for three. We're pregnant right now, so I'm hoping it's only one baby. And then I don't wanna have another baby after that. So we'll see. Um, okay. Could put a little reading nook. Yeah, we could put like office desks there too. I also think that it would be nice to have another bathroom up here. Um, even if it's just a hall bathroom. I would like it to be more than that, though. So maybe I'll make this bedroom a little smaller. We could do that. That actually works. Because this could be a bathroom and then bedroom, bedroom, bedroom. Wait, we only need four bedrooms, don't we? Because uh, <coughs> the parents would be here. Then like one, two, three kids. So actually that's like all we need really. Oh yeah, but also we wanted a guest room and a fifth bedroom just in case we have twins. That's true. Is this for a legacy challenge? Yeah, this is for my Sims and Bloom family. It's a very new challenge. So if you wanted to get caught up, you could. I upload it to my YouTube channel and then you'd be caught up with us but this is only episode three so very easily caught up uh, also thanks for the follows welcome in guest slash office room just in case yeah also yeah we could do a wellness spot in the bedroom because uh pedal likes yoga so this would be a good yoga spot that's true you guys are smart okay well let's figure out the downstairs floor plan really quick i'm feeling like this side of the house gives more like living room vibes um, we also need to figure out where our back door will be. I was kind of thinking, like, I like doing bathrooms <laughs> behind the stairs. So I'm thinking maybe this can be a hall bathroom downstairs. Uh, so that's already three bathrooms that we have. And then maybe our back door is over here. I have to figure out where that new door is. Where are you? Kind of like this. Um... You're lurking and watching, making report cards. Oh, that's fun. Well, thanks for thanks for hanging out with us. I'm new here. Is that your cat? Oh yeah, this is Olivia. Um, she gets scritches every time someone follows me on Twitch. So you can imagine that's probably why she sits here. Um, <laughs> yeah, she she likes to hang out with us while we stream. Um, hi Megan. Hello. Sorry, I know I'm not looking at chat too much right now. I'm just like. I'm in build mode. Don't talk to me. I'm in build mode or something. I don't know. Um, don't talk to me. I'm having enrichment time in my enclosure. Thank you for redeeming scratches for Olivia. It's a traditional area for bathrooms. Is it really normal to have bathrooms behind the stairs? In my house growing up, uh, under our stairs, we had a closet and, a a pantry. That was our tornado shelter. You're here for comfy build vibes? Perfect. Do you think if I text Tony, I need water, he'll fill up my water for me? Hold on. 
Hello, you're so cute and I love you. Will you please fill up my water, woo woo? Let's see if he does it. If not, divorce him. Yeah, I think I think that's grounds for divorce. We can all add him in chat. No, it's it's fine. I don't want to bother him if he's busy. <laughs> Two vegetarians get in an argument. Is it still called beef? Oh my god, Brie. Why are you like this? <laughs> oh my god, Brie. Anyways, um, I usually shout, oh husband who loves me through the house. No, that's funny. That's funny. Okay. Our upstairs is really good. This is a really good floor plan. Now we just need to figure out downstairs. I'm kind of thinking like living room vibes. We could even have some like bigger, big windows over here again, potentially. Like, I feel like that's really nice. Um, I even like the idea of having another big window here, but I don't know, maybe not. But I think that's nice. Um, this, however, is giving me... Is this giving kitchen? Is this giving kitchen or... This is a weird little ugh, space over here. I'm not sure how I feel about this. Where would my kitchen be? I could do it along this wall here. <gasps> Hamlet! Oh my gosh, that's a one-year resub. Can we get some pride emotes in chat? Thank you. How are we feeling today? Am I liking the pack? I am having such a great time with the pack. And I'm feeling a lot better today. Thank you so much for asking. I'm feeling very good. I feel like I could probably do like a guest room here. And then what if we had like kitchen on either side wall here and then I'm watching you I don't know we could do like table in here I feel like this could be an office potentially too and then this could be a dining space maybe And we could have another bathroom there. No, don't like that. Not a fan of that shape either. Maybe this is an office and this is a guest bathroom. <laughs> Excuse my cough. Uh, thank you for the bits, Hamlet. I appreciate it. Maybe place filler furniture. Oh yeah, we'll we'll do that once I feel like I want to try out a floor plan. I'm just thinking like, can I even fit a bed in here comfortably? Like not really. This makes more sense to be the office. What if I do it like that? For our bathroom. Because so I could always do a shower instead of a bathtub. Oh my gosh, have a good birthday, Susan. That's exciting. <laughs> oh, Mama Karina, you're so sweet. I'm glad that the vibes are good. The vibes are vibing. Um, no, I think I need that to be like that because I was going to put the bed like right here. Well, no, I can't put the bed there if the door is there. The bed might be here or here. It's like a puzzle that you're kind of figuring out. We could have an archway like this. I have door to office, door to bathroom, 
door to guest room. Kind of in this little hallway. This space feels very weird, but I feel like we could do a, a table here and then the kitchen is kind of over here. I'm just not too sure if I like the vibes, but I don't think there's anything wrong with having the kitchen be like this, kind of. It's more like a walkthrough kitchen to go to the outside. Um... And then I guess I'm at a loss for what this room would be. Because I feel like if this is the living room, would this be the guest room then? A playroom? Oh wait, yeah! We should do a kid's play area. Hold on a second, you're so smart. Duh, I want to make like a little a little playpen. Can't I do that? Isn't there like a new fence? What if we just made like a, a little fenced in like kids play? You know, I don't, this might just be me, but like, I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> Maybe I put the fence inside the room. Not a mirror milk room? No, unfortunately not a mirror milk room. And then isn't there like a little gate or something? Like what if we did, what if we did something like that? Where it's like, oh yeah, kids, come on in and play. We could have another door to the outside right here too. Kind of if they want to go from the backyard to their little playroom. Potty room? Well, we, we already have a bunch of bathrooms, so we should be good on that end. Um, there's a bathroom right here, actually. Which I could make a little bit bigger. We can make that into a larger bathroom. Honestly. Um, changing table, reading nook in that corner? Yeah. Maybe a totally open room with multiple arches. I don't know. I kind of like the vibes of this. Like, this is the playpen area. Take the door out of the kitchen and then do a wraparound kitchen. A wraparound kitchen? Like, are you talking about... Oh, you're talking about doing, like, this kind of kitchen. Like this. There's a new arch from the pack. Oh, is there really? Let me look. Oh, you're talking about this one. That's short, though. Why does she look like that? <laughs> Why does she look like that? Oh, it's because I'm on medium wall height. Um... I don't think I like that. I, it's good to know we have that arch now, but I don't think... Why does it... Like, am I just complaining too much? Even if this wasn't short wall height. Let's say we do it on normal wall height. That still be looking a little short. I don't know. It definitely does not look good with the taller walls. Yeah, I think we can agree with that. Um, but that's okay. It's worth a shot. So now we have, like, back door here. Then this can be bathroom door. Um, we have door to office, bathroom, guest room. And then upstairs, we would have main bedroom, kid bedroom, kid bedroom, kid bedroom, bathroom. And then this is also bathroom. Huge bathroom for the parents, so that way we can have, like, potty training in here, maybe. Um, I think that might, like, be the vibes. I think we might have figured it out. I also like that these bedrooms have big windows and we can put some big windows on the side too. I think we might have cracked the code, everyone. We have everything we need. We have one, two, three, four bathrooms. We have one, two, three, four, five bedrooms. Living room space, lots of space for the kids. We can do whatever we want with this playroom. 
We have kitchen. We can do a little dining here, a little family dining nook. I might even uh, make that a little smaller for the guest room. I think I will. Oh, I think I will. So that way it just, it doesn't feel as crowded. So we can get a dining table here. Um, yeah, and then we have our porch over here that will lead into like a nice sized backyard. And it looks good. Like I really like how it looks from the outside so far. It's cute, you like it? Oh my God. Oh, yeah, the, the freeze thing is nice. I like it too. Okay, okay. Um, I'm going to do our backyard fence. Did we get a new backyard fence? I don't think so. No, that's like a porch fence. Okay, well, let's just use this one then. Um, Dang, I don't really want to scoot this forward, but this, this side yard is going to be real skinny, y'all. Real skinny. Almost like too skinny. That's okay. We're going to have a, a lot of space over here. I think it can be like that. And then we can even have like a little entryway over here, maybe to the backyard, just from the sidewalk. Yeah, we can put the garbage bin there. That's a good idea. I think that's cute. Is that big enough for a tree house? Because I haven't gotten to use the tree house yet. It is. We could fit a tree house. It's going to be real tight though. I think maybe I need to move this whole lot over like one tile. Oops. Deleted everything. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Hi, OMG Allergy. How are you? Hi, Jennifer. Are we feeling bonita today, chat? I feel bonita. Wonderful! Because you look bonita. I love that TikTok. Okay, treehouse. I want the treehouse. Wow, that's going to take up a lot of space. Am I able to put it on the edge of the lot like this chat? Or will it not work if I do that? That's all I need to know. I never feel bonita. That TikTok sound is safe in my head all day. <laughs> I feel like maybe if I put it like that, it will just overhang over the fence. So it'll be okay. The treehouse is absolutely enormous. Yeah, like, how am I supposed to fit this? We'll, we'll try it. We'll find out. We'll find out together. It'll be a little experimente. Um, in the meantime... Wow, I get to landscape with such ugly dead plants. This is exactly what I imagined when I said I wanted to build a house for my family. So glad... Dang it, is it not gonna let me? I'm too close to the edge of the lot here. Well, I'm on the edge. That's fine. I didn't want it there anyways, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. That's what I wanted. Uh, Thank you for the follow, welcome on in. Scorches for Olivia. You're gonna do a garden? You know, that's the problem, right? We also need to do a garden. Uh, I probably should have built this on a bigger lot. <laughs> but I feel bad deleting someone's build that is new to the pack. But I kind of want to delete that, that build right there. Because if we had more space, we'd be fine. No, I have not saved. I should save. Do you think I should? Do you think I should just move this house over to here and delete this? Have I done the interior? No, not yet. Not yet. 
we're just trying to figure out the exterior. We got like our floor plan ready to go. Okay. I'm going to delete it. I'm sorry to whoever built it. But I'm getting rid of your house. Okay. All right. I uploaded it. Let me bulldoze this now. I'm going to have to move my sims again. Hold on. Hold on, everyone. Time to move. My kids are like, Mom, it's 4 a.m. Why are we outside in the rain? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. I just feel like we need a bigger backyard because I need not only a garden, but I also want to have the tree house. So that's a 50 by 40. Oh, I feel bad. This is the Michelsons. More like the Bicholsons. Get out. Oh, hold on. I have to... No, I'm going to bulldoze the lot. It's fine. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Hi, welcome in. I can move them somewhere else. Don't worry. I'll deal with that later. Do you feel bad about what you've done, Petal? Okay, let me... Let me... Go into build mode. And go to the gallery. And place the house I just made. I actually really like how this house looks. Oh my god, we have so much more space. Oh, thank but Jesus. This is going to make my life a lot better. Thanks for understanding, chat. I feel bad for that other house. Yeah, don't worry though. I'll, I'll move that family somewhere else later. At least I intend to. Um, okay, I'm going to move them this whole thing back a little bit then. Maybe more like here. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in, friends. Now we get the shell. Well, I only uploaded it to my gallery, so... You don't get the shell. Unless you want it. But I already started working on it. I don't know. I will upload this house when I'm done with it. How about that? Just in case you all would like to play in it. Uh, Kelly, thank you for the six month resub. Thank you. I'll upload it when I'm done with it. Because I have... We, here's the deal. We won the lottery, so I'm not going to limit my money at all. So I will finish this house today. It will be completely finished. And then I will give it to you all. Sound like a plan? Life hack, by the way. Is this going on YouTube? Yeah, this will be... This is technically episode three of our Sims in Bloom Let's Play. So say hi to YouTube because this will be on YouTube. Um, I think I mentioned in episode two that we were going to be building today. So there won't be as much gameplay. But... I think building streams are also a whole lot of fun. So I will definitely upload this. Because sometimes people like to build along with me or see what I do and try to replicate it. Um, so I got you. I love the windows. I know, aren't they great? They're from the new, they're from the new pack. Hi, YouTube. Okay. YouTube commenters look so beautiful today. Wow. All right. So we have so much more space now. I'm going to do another backyard fence. But this time, less restrictions. Uh, I don't even think I'm going to make it that big. But maybe I'll have some area, like, outside the fence that they can access. 
like in the back of the lot, just in case we want to add some stuff on later, you know? Whoops, I went one too far. Yeah, I think that's a good size. Um, I feel like maybe even our tree house could be like back here or something in the wooded area, but we'll figure it out. Uh, we are going to do like a little shed, a little greenhouse shed. Um, yeah, I think like maybe they can be like, oh yeah, this tree was behind our house and we turned it into a tree house. I think that's a really cool vibe. I also like the idea of this being accessible from the road as well. Um, okay. I'm doing a lot of outside stuff. Normally I don't do outside stuff until, <laughs> until later. But here we are, I guess. I don't know what I want to put in there. I could do these hedges, I suppose. This is such a little weird... cranny. <laughs> Uh, is this the lot outside that the tree clips into the lot? I think actually uh, the lot we were building on has the tree that clips into the lot. So maybe. But not this one. I think this one doesn't. Could he fit the trash can there? I could, but I think I'll find a better spot for the trash can. Um. Okay. I don't know if I should continue doing outdoor stuff or if we should actually furnish the house. Next. So, I don't know. Did you just say cranny? I did. We had a little, a little cranny. We should do the inside. Yeah, I feel like maybe just so I don't forget, I'm going to put like a little... A little gardening shed for a uh, petal. Like right here, maybe? Just so I don't forget that we need it. Um, is it going to be a greenhouse? I think, yeah. I think maybe I want it to be a greenhouse. So I'm going to use this roof because her passion is um gardening so we got to make sure she's got what she needs and then we're gonna do a glass roof who i am not a fan of whatever that is i'll just do that i guess that's a nice house isn't it good we don't have any budget, so we're going all out. Um, okay, medium glass wall height doors. So I'll do something like this. Okay. All right. Well. Moving on. Shall we furnish the inside? Now, this is fun because we know all of the Sims that are going to be living here already, except for the unborn child, which is hopefully just a child. We don't actually know. <laughs> I'm really counting on it being only one kid because otherwise uh, our guest room is going to become a kid bed room really fast. So fingers crossed it's only one. Um, Thank you for the resub for four months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, this is a nice house. Didn't I check during last stream? I'm going to be honest with you, I don't remember. Um, I've been playing too much Sims uh, for YouTube since then. So I literally, I don't remember. So I don't know. We'll find out together. What challenge is this? Uh, this is the Sims in Bloom challenge. And this is us building our house for our Sims. We got a herringbone tile floor. Interesting. So that's the only new floor we got with the with the pack. Good to know. 
Uh, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Yeah, if you want to watch this uh, challenge from the beginning, it's actually uploaded over on my YouTube channel. So feel free to check it out over there. Let me just do wooden floors. There we go. Also, I feel like I need to not have these green doors anymore. Let's let's pick a door. Which door are we going to have for the house? We have to decide now. Um, We could do this more modern door, but I don't actually know. Because I feel like this house does have kind of a modern vibe. So maybe. Um... My infant disappeared today, but I think it was a MCC glitch. Oh, really? That's scary. I hope that doesn't happen to me. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. This is just my favorite door, so I think I'll use these ones. I just really like these doors. Oh, don't worry, friend. There is no such thing as late. No such thing as late. So you never have to apologize for when you arrive, because when you arrive is when you arrive, you know? That is how it works. We should save a lot, maybe? We can save. Yeah, I don't mind. I love those doors, too. Yeah, I think that they're really good doors. Oh, I quite like them. Hmm. Hmm. Does that match the floor? Not really. Three years. Hello! A lot of time. Lots of talk about lobsters and mustard. Hey! And I can't wait for another 100 baby challenge. It already started. It already started on YouTube. So, wait no longer. Thank you for the three year resub. I really love you. I hope you're doing well today. Can't wait to watch. Oh, I hope you like it. <laughs> Thank you. Can everyone say hi to Kay in the chat? Hi, Kay. Hi, Hadley. Hadley is so cute. Um. Oh, I should probably do the rest of the windows, too. What do you think? Because we don't have windows on the rest of my house. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. You're going to watch it tonight? Yes, let's go. Good, because episode two is coming out tomorrow of the 100 Baby Challenge. So make sure you're ready. You're going to be able to comment baby name suggestions in the comment section, so don't want to miss that opportunity. There we go. I think that's fine. Right? Yeah, that's fine. Um, you get another scritches for Olivia soon? Nice. We love to see it. I might just do like this on the side over here. Um, that's kind of what I'm planning on doing for the kitchen. Just having a window there. And then I guess a window there. Okay. Cool. Very good. Uh, new Not Saberi episode soon? Yeah, hopefully, hopefully within the next few days. I have it recorded. I just have not had time to edit it because I've been... A little bit focused on the 100 baby challenge, so that has been my priority. All right, there we go. Some big windows in the back there for our playroom. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do windows on the sides here. I feel like I might not. That twist in the comments? I know. I was like freaking out when I saw it. I was like, there's no way. There's no way. But the commenters noticed it and I didn't even notice. So it's crazy. 
I'm currently playing Super Sim right now, and my Sim is a vampire along with my husband, and she's pregnant. Through a whoopsie woohoo, I do not want to experience a vampire infant. Oh no. Oh no. The windows? Aren't they so pretty? Look at this one. It's a triangle window. Can I comment on the 100 infant challenge? Yeah, if you want to. How many infants are you at now in your recording? I'll never tell. You'll have to wait until tomorrow to find out. You like the triangle one? Nice. Also, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Scratches for Olivia. What did I miss in the comments? Uh, I pinned it, so you can go to the pinned comments and look if you'd like to. Um, it was crazy. Absolutely crazy. Oh my god, wait. Is that not the cutest thing? Because she's like into gardening and stuff. We have a little bee window. Oh, I love it. This house looks so cozy. Thank you. Yeah, I'm super into it. Okay, I'm pretty happy with the windows on the first floor. So let's do second floor windows now. I want to do like this maybe. I believe that's the level I placed them at. Yeah, okay. Do a little flower box back there too. Hi, sweet music woman. How are you? Okay, and then let's put maybe on this side again, like this. Very good. And then I was going to use these over here. Nice. The best situation made you laugh so hard. I know. I was like, what the heck is going on? That was crazy. Unexpected is an understatement. I think I was floored. That, that happened um you just saw the scream movie and now you're eating pizza fun love that for you all right i think that's it for windows then oh wait no i had to do this side um hmm I think that's fine. The parents' bedroom doesn't have too much light in it, though. Maybe one more window. Just like here. That's better. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Okay. That helps a lot. I feel like the house looks a lot more... Um, a lot more lively. So... Having actual windows in it. Okay, let's do the doors. So, bathroom, bedroom, 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 bathroom. Hi, Olivia. Is there something you want to tell everyone? Is there something you, is there something you had to say? Goob. Hey. He has something to say. Hi. Do you mind filling up my water? Is that okay? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Here we go. <sighs> Hi, Olivia. Thank you for your ever-flowing wisdom, Olivia. She's like, yeah, I know. This is good. This is really good. Okay, which bedroom should go to which kid? So we have two kids right now and we have, we're pregnant. So one of these will be a nursery. Do you think the oldest kid should get the biggest room? I think that's only fair, right? I feel like this room's the biggest. So this should go to Aster. Thank you.
Okay. So, Aster will get this big room. You think the nursery should go close to the parents' room? Okay, then this will be the nursery. This one right here. <gasps> Lady Lotharia, thank you for the 13 months. I hope you're doing well. It's good to see you. He's definitely the favorite. <laughs> okay, so this will be Aster, this will be Forest, and this will be Nursery. Um, let's figure out what tile we want to use for the bathrooms next. I'm kind of just thinking like... Oh no. This tile for bathrooms? I feel like that's probably fine. New tiles? Are there new tiles? I don't think we have any new tiles. Oh, wait, you're right. We do. Oh, my God. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, let's do those. I forgot. I keep thinking that there's, like, no new floors. Okay, cool. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Can confirm as the youngest of three. I got the smallest room. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. There are new wall tiles too. Yeah, I did see we got some new wallpaper with growing together. Um, is this supposed to be like a bathroom wallpaper, do you think? Yeah, we can do that. I actually kind of like that. It's kind of like a minty green color. Not so berry is thriving. Okay. Um, I think for the rest of the house, I'm just going to paint the walls white for now, and then we can figure out color scheme a little bit later. I feel like I usually try to pick furniture out first. Oh, this is so clean. This is like a move-in ready house. It's all ready to go. We just have to furnish it. That's so exciting. Um, I finished my family shell. I hope you like it. <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. They only had the wall, but Deli asked for a matching floor. Oh, really? Well, thank goodness for Deli. Am I right? Ooh, advocating for more stuff. Oh, yeah. Didn't they fix the uh, railings? Hold on a moment. This is big. I think they fixed it so the railings only go on one side. <gasps> yeah, it's not clipping into the wall. Oh my god. It's still doing this thing though. I thought that they fixed that. I guess not. Interesting. Don't even think about being nice to me right oh, they're now. still working oh on that? God. Okay. Show us, show us in the Hi, Dika! Thank you so much. How are you today? Dika Dikerson. It's still clipping, but not as bad. It's also um, not clipping through this wall, like, visibly, so that's nice. That's really nice. I like that. Okay, where should we start? Do you think we should start on the kitchen? I think maybe the kitchen is a good place to start. So maybe, maybe we start there. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Kitchen, yes. Okay, kitchen is in here. We did not get new cabinets, sir. I'm trying to decide which... Um, we got new appliances. I'm wondering which cabinets go good with them. Disgusting. I hate it. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Thank you. Hmm. Which cabinets match the best? I don't know. These ones kind of match? Not really. I do really like this set, though. Hmm. Oh, welcome on in, uh, Danny. It's good to have you here. I'm sorry that your cow plant died, though. Um, uh, parenthood cabinets? Parenthood. Do... 
Do all these swatches have gold handles on them? I guess not. What if I do the non-gold handles? I always like the dream home decor cabinets. Yeah, those are the ones I usually use. But I want to see if I can branch out a little today. I guess these look nice. Do we want to do a blue kitchen? Or that. I feel like that's kind of nice and clean. Hmm. Maybe a dream home decorator and a dark swatch? I don't know. I always use these ones. So I'm trying to decide if I want to use them again or if I want to try to like try something new. I think maybe we'll try the parenthood cabinets. I feel like I never use these ones. So let's go with that. Oh my gosh! Aika, thank you so much for the first time sub. Chat, you know what that means. Enjoy your emotes and ad free viewing, but most importantly, enjoy your beautiful new smile. Very good. Very good. Smile with us. <laughs> if y'all are just joining us, by the way, uh, we're currently building for my Sims and Bloom family. I just started the Sims and Bloom legacy. That's illegal. What are you doing so welcome in. Why was six afraid of seven? Because seven, eight, nine. Wow, Brie, I've never heard that joke before. <sighs> Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel like double sync is not unreasonable either. Um, please pet Olivia. I can give her scritches, sure. Sub scritches? Sims in Bloom, can you explain it? It's hard to explain easily, but we can give you a link to the website if you want to look at the rules. Um, but the first generation, I'm... Basically, playing a sim who is really into gardening and has, like, a cow plant obsession. So, that's basically all you need to know for the first generation. But yeah, sorry. It's, like, definitely not something I can explain easily. Because it's got a lot of rules and stuff. Okay. Oh my gosh, Ronnie, whoa, with the 800 bits? Holy cannoli. Thank you so much. Um, And thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Okay, let's do a little stove hood right here. And then I think this might be a good place for our trash can. Um, I can't decide. Should I just go with this one? Gross, disgusting. disgusting. I hate it. Thank you for the bits. I missed your last stream. Is your cow plant still alive? Yes. Um, if you're just joining us, this is episode three of our Sims in Bloom Let's Play, and I won the lottery. So I'm basically not giving myself a budget at all. I'm just going to keep giving myself money until I'm done building. So this house will be finished by the end of today. Um... Do you think I should do the money trash can? Here's my problem with the money trash can. It's really ugly and it makes me upset. I feel like I might be the only one who feels that way. But like, I don't know. It just looks ugly. I feel like maybe we'll get enough money from uh, growing plants and stuff, maybe. Ew, I don't want your filthy sinner bits. Oh my gosh. Thank you for the bits, Hamlets. There's a new hood that goes with the stove. Is there really? Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, this is a good hood. Let's go. Thanks for telling me. That's really nice looking. I agree that the trash can is ugly. Thank you. I wish they would make us a prettier... Um, trash can <laughs> also thanks for the follows welcome in friends 
But yeah, I'm uploading this series to my YouTube channel, so feel free to check it out over there if you want to watch. Or if you miss an episode, it will all be going up over there. I just posted part two of episode one today. I had to split the first episode into two parts because I played for seven hours. Um, so I think I have a little bit of a problem. Where are the new curtains? Here they are. I was just thinking these would be nice, like... Curtains for in our kitchen? I don't know. What do you guys think? We can always change the color depending on what color scheme we go with. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thanks, friends. Are they so good? Yeah, I really, I like them a lot. Okay. All right. Well, that's our kitchen vibe. We were going to put a table over here. We currently have a family of four. But my sim is pregnant, so we're expecting another kid. Hopefully it's just one. Um... Oh, wow. What swatches does this have? Eh. I don't know. Should we try to fit a table in here? Or should I do like a table more central maybe? Like this? I kind of want to use the new table. But at the same time, I don't know if I'm really liking the fabricated vibes of it. This looks straight out of eco lifestyle. Or is it just me? Um, also, Brie, thank you for the bits. Oh my gosh. It's overswept. I can't believe it. I don't know. I don't think we can do a bench, maybe? Let me look at the chairs we got. This is my first time building with the new stuff, by the way, so... Take it easy on me. Huh. Now, why are the chair legs white? We could also pick an accent color. We don't have to do just plain colors. I don't know if I'm if I'm here for this vibe. I don't know. I don't know if I like it. Thanks for the follows, friends. Welcome in. Yeah, the big window gives me eco vibes too. It feels catered towards the rec center. Yeah. I could see that. I think maybe I'll go with one of the old tables. One of my favorite tables to use is actually this one. I really like this table, so I think I will... I'll use it, and then I'll use some of my favorite chairs as well. We could get some fun accent colors. I don't know. What's a good accent color for a kitchen? Blue red do some reds in here wasn't there a red curtain yellow <laughs> y'all always want me to do yellow evil evil yours is currently green thank you for the hype train everyone i appreciate it would it be weird to put the table up against this wall here I feel like that makes more walking space. Um, and then obviously we need a high chair too. So maybe we could just put the high chair like here for the kid to try food. I think that's kind of nice. A window bench or something. Yeah, we'll figure out what to put in by the window. Green might be pretty. We could do green. I like that. Is there a new high chair? There's not a new high chair, to my knowledge. Um, I'm pretty sure the high chairs we had, we already had, right? Like this one. And then there's like this one. So yeah. Hi, welcome in. Hello. Yeah, we're on this really big lot, by the way. This is what the house looks like on the outside. What do you think, chat? <laughs> this is what we've been working on all stream. It's going to be a really big um, 
Really big family home. I'll upload it when I'm done. But I'm not limiting my packs, so there's that. It looks amazing. Oh my gosh, you guys are so nice. Thank you. Okay. Is there a green in here? There is. It's kind of like that. I don't know. Maybe I'll figure out decorations later. In this little space over here, we have to figure out what to put. Um, hmm. It's an awkward little area, but I like the natural light that comes in. Maybe this might be dumb, but maybe we put like the dining table there. And what if we did like a little coffee bar space? Right here. Would that be weird? That might just fill up the space a little bit better is what I'm what I'm trying to think. Like we could have like little little snack shelves going on. I think that's kind of fun. I feel like we need something in this space, though. You like that? Okay, yeah. I think I like that better. Um, and then we need something in this space. So let's see really quick. Um, surfaces. Let's see about shelves. Now, my sim is into gardening, so I feel like this almost works, but I don't know if this would be in the kitchen is the only thing. We could do this. That's kind of a nice... Uh, it doesn't take up too much space. It's kind of skinny. Could do a thermostat and a bulletin board. Oh, that's true. We could, instead of doing a shelf there, we could do like the chores thing on the wall. I know which one you're talking about. I just have to find it. Where are you? This thing? That's kind of good. We can move that over there again. I wish that I could like move this up a little bit, but I think if I move that up, they won't be able to use it anymore. Some aprons. Ooh, that's a good thing we could put on the wall. We have these bags. Where are the aprons? Oh, there they are. We could do one of those little, um, one of the clutter items that comes with this. Hold on. Hold on a moment. I need to go into kits. I can't sort by kits, but what if we did like this? Because this is kind of by the front door. So what if we put like our, our little mail slot thing right here? I feel like that makes a lot of sense, right? Like, oh, grab the keys and then go out the front door. Also, thank you for the follows. Welcome in, friends. Welcome. Um, I kind of like the vibes of this. Does your sim family have any pets? Uh, we have a cow plant, if you want to count that as a pet, but other than that, these sims do not have a pet. And that's mostly because I don't know if I could handle a pet right now, because I'm already struggling with just the infants. You know what I mean? It's hard. Yeah, I like the clutter too. I think it's really good. Okay. What kind of rug should we put under here? We have this new rug, but I feel like I need more of a square or a circle rug to fit under this. That's too big. Hmm. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in, everyone. Which rug? I could just do this. 
feel like that's kind of nice. Okay. I feel like we kind of have the structure of this room set up to a point where I'm happy with it. And we can come back when I... The way I build is I like to put most things in their spots first and then I come back and clutter later. So I feel like that's good for now. And then we can come back and uh, get some clutter and stuff. Let me give myself some more money. Hold on. I have Giazzo. So annoying. Um, money. Let's just give myself like 50,000 simoleons. There we go. Um, let's save too. That's a good idea. Let's let's save really quick. Hi, Seafoam Pudding. I'm doing great. How are you? Um, I don't know if my Sims would drink tea or coffee, but I think maybe Petal would drink tea because she could probably grow some of the herbs herself. So I'll probably make a little tea maker. I think that makes sense to me. Maybe we put a little microwave right there, too. Hi, welcome in. I like how this room is organized. Yeah, it's it's a very, like, awkward, long room, but I think we made it work for us. Okay. Looking at the floor plan, where do we go next? What is our next attack angle for this house? Do we want to take on the living room? The living room is going to be a big one. Or we can go somewhere small, like the office or the guest bedroom. I don't know. You're trying to set up a new family with a migraine? No, that's bad. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Um, Really cute kitchen. Would eat there? Really? Thanks. Okay, I see a couple of offices. We'll do the office next then. Office it is. Okay. Um, Obviously, we need a desk. So let's put a desk in here. Uh, do we want to use the new desk is the question. Where is the new desk? This one. This strikes me as more of a kid's desk. Right? So I probably shouldn't put it in here for my adult office. I should save that for a kid's bedroom. There's another new one as well. Oh, there is this one. We could use this one. This one almost looks like a built-in when you put it up against the wall like that. Do we have like a built-in desk moment? Also, thank you so much for gifting a sub, Logical Alex. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, maybe, maybe we do this. I think that's nice. Is that where I want it though? Or should I put it... Should I put it here? Maybe here is better. Um. Oh my gosh, my shell's the first one you ever completed. Let's go. I'm proud of you. I do have a shell challenge out if you all like shell challenges. Feel free to try it. I've never used this swatch. I'm going to try to use this chair swatch. It looks a little broken though. Look at that. <laughs> Um, okay. I feel like we should probably decide on a wallpaper for in this office. Um, or at least painting a wall. Hmm. I kind of like that. I think that's kind of nice. Like a little bit of a green, calming green color. We could probably find some curtains to match. Pretty easily, like that. I like that. Looks like Nightbot's sub expired. Oh no. Nightbot, where are you? Let me gift Nightbot a sub. Okay. Wow. OMG, Rochella, thanks for gifting a sub. Okay, we're good. Don't worry, he's back everyone. <laughs> I love that color. Yeah, I think that this is a nice color. We can work with this. Um, 
think this like funky rug kind of matches the vibes too. And then I think we can put like a bookshelf on this wall here and call it good. Oh, these are kind of fun. That looks weird. I don't think I should use that one. Hmm. Oh, wait, I didn't know this was a bookshelf. That's actually nice. I quite like that. That's a good bookshelf. It's like full of books. Did you just pay yourself? I totally did pay myself. <laughs> no, it actually cost me $2.50. Um. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. I think I can give Nightbot a sub for free on my channel. Um, but I've never tried to figure out how to do it. Because I'm... Um, just bad at stuff like that. So... <laughs> but I do think you can... When you get partnered on Twitch, I think you are able to... Gift like five people permanent subs. It's either like three or five. And I just have never figured that out. So like if you have a significant other, if you have certain bots that you always want to be subscribed, like you could do that. But hey, when will this be posted to YouTube? I missed the beginning. It's already there. Uh, episode one is fully posted and um, I'll be posting episode two shortly. I just tomorrow I'm posting the next episode of our 100 baby challenge, 100 infant challenge. And then I have to decide, like, when to post my Not So Berry episode as well, so. Just trying to juggle and figure it out, you know? Um, would you like me to find out? Yeah, I mean, if anyone knows, here's the problem with me, though. Is people will tell me all these cool things that I'm able to do when I'm live streaming. And I'm like, oh, yeah, that's awesome. I'll do it when I get off. And then I don't. Because I just want to walk away from my computer. <laughs> So it's bad. I'll like reach out to you at like 2 p.m. and be like, hey, I'm ready to do this. And you're like, Shella, what? I like, I'm not available. And I'll be like, well, I guess I'll never do it then. Because the, like, this is the time. <laughs> um, I, it's, you know, it's something I'm working on as a human. I'm just bad at that. Um, you only need to send a ticket to Twitch regarding that. Oh, really? That's all you have to do? You just be like, hey. Perma sub these people. Is that it? Is that how easy it is? Oh my god. See, that's embarrassing for me. I am probably the worst streamer on the planet. I would like an award for that. Thank you. Um, I'm gonna put this in here because she likes plants. I think that this is a cute office. Can I get any postcards? No, I don't have debug on. That's fine. You're so valid for that. Thank you. I'm always available. Hashtag unemployed. Okay, true. I always watch them on YouTube. I know watching ads helps. Well, thank you. Yeah, it does actually benefit me more if you all watch my VODs on YouTube instead of Twitch. But I never want to ask you to wait because usually it takes me a couple days to like get them posted. So, you know. Um, I'm just putting these items out here because I'll probably want them in my kitchen, so don't mind me. I think a little clock is cute to have in here to keep track of the time. Ah! Oh, that scared me so bad. Jump scare. Oh my gosh. Lunar Ghosties, hello. Welcome on in. How was your stream? Thanks for raiding me. Um, if you're new here, my name is Shella. I use she, her pronouns, and I'm building a giant home for my sims right now so hopefully you like building stuff um, but welcome in i hope you had a great stream what were you up to today hello um thank you sorry for the jump scare no you're fine honestly it's my fault because i should probably turn down my alerts but here we are <laughs> that's on me don't worry about it um oh my gosh People recognize each other. What's happening? 
This is the Sims community. I should expect this. I feel like everyone knows everyone in the Sims community. Uh, these are my friends. OMG, I didn't know you had friends, Lulu. I'm so happy for you. Wow, this is great. Wow. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, these are my friends. I met Ali at TwitchCon last year. Oh my God, I was at TwitchCon. No way. No way right now. Uh, we're doing the 100 infant challenge today. Oh my God, bestie, how many infants are you on? Because I also just started the 100 infants challenge, but I'm doing that on YouTube. So I did not get very far. I only have one episode out so far. Uh, but the next one's going up tomorrow, so hopefully she did better in the future. Oh, I feel like these are kind of perfect for in here, like a little office space. Uh, also, thank you for the follow, Scorches for Olivia. Welcome in. Thank you, Beely. Not Shella's Shade of Lulu. Nice. Oh, Tina with the 69 bits. Thank you. I love you. I love this sweater. Thanks. This is my new sweater. Thank you. <laughs> she has four. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I, I have two infants right now in my 100 baby challenge, and I feel like... I already can't do it. So am I in danger? Be real with me. Am I in danger? Because I don't know if I can do more than two infants. <laughs> I think I'm in danger. I don't know. I might go insane. Well, I'm already there. So I guess that's fine. If that's the worst that can happen. I already beat you there. That's fine. I can do that. I can handle that. I absolutely am. Little Simsy has seven and she was struggling. Oh no. Well. That sucks. You might want to end it when you have four. Okay, okay. I'm loving the encouragement. I'm loving it. I'm loving the realism. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, if y'all are just joining us uh, from the raid or maybe you're just popping in, this is my uh, Sims in Bloom series that I just started. Uh, this is episode three and I won the lottery. So I'm now building my Sims a massive family home with no restrictions because I deserve that. I deleted all my lottery money because I didn't want it. But um, I believe I deserve this. It's my birthright. So thank you for understanding. Where is the like the box that I can put my stuff in? Y'all know what I'm talking about, right? The like, isn't there supposed to be like a box that I put my legacy stuff in? Yeah, we won the lottery on episode one. It was crazy. I lost my mind. Like, I felt so sad. <laughs> I was like, wait, it's too easy. Keepsake box. Okay, let me look that up. Keepsake. Oh. <gasps> are you kidding me? Oh my god, these new backpacks are so cute. Okay, so I just choose one of these. The truly ornate keepsake box. Oh, I just like this one. That one's fine. I feel like maybe we put this in my office to keep all of our stuff um, safe in here. What do you say? What do you say? Iconic. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, the, the first episode is fully on my YouTube if you want to watch it. Follow along with the series. I don't know. I feel like it's hit or miss with people if they like watching legacy stuff on YouTube, but if you're like me and you lay in bed awake at night pondering your existence, um, then perhaps consider watching my Let's Plays. I got you. Um, also, thank you for the follow, stick bug. Welcome in. Legacies is where it's at. Yeah, you get it. You understand. Um, we're also almost to a new subscriber milestone, so that's exciting. 
Maybe we'll hit it. Maybe we won't. Only time will tell. So yeah. If you take photos, don't put them in the box. It glitched my photos to look black. Oh no. Well, thank you for the warning. I will be sure to heed the warning. Because that sounds really sad. Um, I don't know how much clutter I want to put on here. I feel like maybe one of her kids made this. And it's like, Mom, I made this for you. And she's like, oh, thanks, sweetie. Uh, I do need more plants in here, though, because she is a plant girly. Oh, what the heck is this? You want to know what I think is infuriating? They added some new plants to the game, but, like, they're clumped together. Like, what is this? Where am I going to fit this? I want just the this Monstera. I just, I want all of them separated. Do they hate us? <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm being dramatic. But also, keeping it real. The modder's already separated it, but then I have to download a mod. And you know how I feel about downloading mods. It's hard for me. I'm just bad at it. Wait, you just reminded me that I'm sitting on cheese. Where did my cheese go? Oh my god. I saw someone say the word cheese in chat, and I've been uh, warming up this cheese with my body for about an hour now. I forgot about my butt cheese. Don't worry about it. It's one of these. So I'm gonna take a little munch. <laughs> Do you ever just forget that you're sitting on cheese, you guys? It's an efficient way to warm it up. Mm mm mm. Yummy. Butt cheese. Don't knock it till you try it. Did I fart in it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This thing's loaded with flavor. I thought I was the only one that sat on cheese. You're not. You're not. I'm just like you. I'm dying at you right now. Oh, well then die, I guess. Mm-mm-mm. Delicioso. Okay. We're going to be here all night. I'm taking too long to build this house. Y'all, are y'all ready for an all-nighter? <clears throat> My mods are like, no. What do you mean, Shella? <laughs> what do you mean, all-nighter, Shella? I feel like I would have... <gasps> oh my god, that scared me. I was like, what do you mean? We would definitely have our, our family photo in here. Definitely. Um, and I might have a picture of the kids on my desk. That is so cute. Look at them. Oh my god, I'm screaming. Screaming, crying, throwing up. That's them uh, where our son was really stinky and our other son was like, why have you forsaken me? Uh, thanks for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. Thank you. Sakasaki used ad permitted term eating your butt. Interesting. Wow. <laughs> no, that's funny. I'm not mad. I think that's hilarious that you just permitted eating your butt. You know me. I love potty humor. I'm literally like seven. Anyways. I think that this office is pretty stinking good. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, chat. Don't worry about it. 
There's literally nothing you need to worry about. Stinky toddler. I'm gonna do a little, um... Oh, that's one of my favorite photos of a uh, petal. That's a good one. Let's do a, a nice little uh, gallery wall on the stairs like that. Look at that. That's beautiful. I was stunned into not clicking anything. Oh. I might pass away when we start getting family poses with infants, right? Look at this. Aren't they so cute? Okay. All right. Do we want to try to tackle the living room next? Or do we want to do the guest room? I'll let chat decide. Guest room or living room? Oh my gosh, Jelly Bean! Thank you for the 15 months! Welcome back! Uh, living room? Guest room? Okay, it looks about split. Down the middle. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Petal and Everett are cute. I will allow one heterosexual couple to have rights. I like that. Thanks for understanding. <laughs> okay, mods, can we make a poll? I couldn't tell. It was too close for which room that chat wants to do next. Either the guest room or the living room are the options. Did I miss scratches for Olivia? Oh my gosh. I will do it for you. And I do it for you. She's snoring right now. I just want you all to know that. Okay, there's a poll if you want to vote. Okay, it looks like living room's winning by more than I thought. We can do the living room. Sure. The living room kind of scares me though. I'm going to be honest with you all. Um, it's really big. Oh my god, Cyan. <laughs> Is there a playroom? Yeah, we actually do have a playroom. We're gonna do this room as like a kid's playroom area. Um, honestly, here's what I might do. I might actually turn this into a half wall. Because... I think that makes sense. Like, we have jail for the toddlers here. We have child jail. But that way they can, like, look over and see the kids. And also, it just opens up the space a lot more. I think that's good. I like it, too. Oh, what is, what is, what is, what is going on? No, you cannot be homophobic like that. Fine, I won't do it. It's because I have the freezy here. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. All right, well, I guess uh, in terms of the TV, I was going to put the TV on that wall, but now that wall is gone. So we're just going to have a nice window behind the TV, which IRL, that would really suck. But this is The Sims, so... I could also just delete the window. Omega lol. Yeah, I might do that. We don't need a window there. It was nice. But I think a big TV will be nicer. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. It was a nice window. Keyword was. Now it's dead. Hold vigil. Um, have this. That feels really small, though. <laughs> like, too small to be a, uh, you know, sore. Instead, I'm going to make a console table. Y'all are about to lose your minds. I'm going to blow your minds. Listen closely, children. This is how you fake it. You just get yourself a nice table. Put it inside the other table. Boom. 
Look at that. You're welcome. I hope I changed your life. Okay. I've already lost my mind? No, that's that's fair. I figured. Mind blown. Yeah. Build hacks with Shellerson. Awesome. Fair, Saki, fair. My life will never be the same. <laughs> okay, we have to decide on a new couch, and I know that we got some couches with the pack, so let's check those ones out first. Okay, yes. What in the... Ooh, she's like an egg. This feels like really a... Uh... Fancy. Huh. Which one? You want to do a sectional couch? But I want to use one of the new couches. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, are there not smaller versions of the couch, though? Left one? The new couch looks like the couch my grandma has. Modern and vintage. Egg couch. Egg. The egg. Okay, more people are saying egg couch. Okay. Oh! <gasps> Egg chairs? Oh my god. Uh, and it looks like a shell pattern. It's meant to be. Okay, we can do that. I like that. I didn't realize it had such beautiful matching chairs. That's really nice. Okay, so we have a new... We do. We have this one and we have... Ooh... Uh, She's interesting. She's trying to be different. She wants to be seen, noticed, perceived. Um, I hate her. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> Dang, rejection sucks. She was not, this is not her house. Like, she might be better for another house, but this is not her moment. And we're not going to give her the audience that she craves. We're not entertaining that in this economy. This, however, no. See, that makes me sad. I could, like, go for the lighter wood, but I like the warm color that we have, so I don't know. Wow, she took a risk and she was judged and hated for it. <laughs> Sorry. Look, I am going to stay true to myself in this build process respectfully. And I hope you all can understand that. I think that could work. Um. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Okay, I want to look at the new rugs. Oh, they're all terrible. Well, no, these are splash pad rugs. Never mind. I was like, what in the psychedelic? No, I, I understand. I understand what's happening. There are some new coffee tables, but I just didn't feel like they were what we're looking for. What I've been looking for. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. See, if I want to use this rug, we can't use those chairs. That's just not it. Um. I have very strong opinions. Got to go with something more like this. That actually kind of matches the colors really well. Um, I like it. I think that matches better. It gets the deep blue of the pillow. I like that. And we can have blue as our accent color. Um, Planet Zoo is on sale right now for 75% off. Wait, that's really good. Any Planet Zooers in the chat? Go get your hack. Sharpay Evans, is that you? <laughs> yes, it's me. Um, 
How many years have I been streaming for? I'm coming up on four years. Whoa, that scared me. <laughs> Why was that so loud? I'm coming up on four years of streaming. Uh, Alaria, thank you for the resub for four months, by the way. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Um. Oh, the old lady from the New World came to my house to stay and help look after my infant and then immediately died in front of my baby. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> That's really tragic. I'm sorry that happened to your poor baby. I think that's traumatizing. Rip to that old lady. Yeah. She's like, hey, I see that you're you have a new kid. Can I help? Traumatize it for life. This build is looking so sweet. Thank you. Uh, this stone is from the new the new pack, actually. I wanted to see if I could use it because like here's the outside of the house just in case you missed it. Uh, the outside of the house, we are using that stone. So I wanted to see if we could um, bring her inside for an interior moment. Interior crocodile alligator. You know? <laughs> no... Do I like that? I do, actually. I like how that looks. Would I recommend the new pack? Um, so far, yes. I will say... I have not played with it too long yet. But... I gotta be honest with you guys. I don't know if there's any, like, profound game-breaking bugs. At least I haven't run in, into anything game breaking. I know that there are like a couple um, annoying like, oh, science babies don't work with this mod or there's a couple like routing issues and stuff like that. But it's not been like this pack is broken. Don't buy it kind of vibes. You know what I mean? So I don't know. It's been pretty good. Pretty good vibes. This is a nice, like, big family living room. Like, holy cannoli. What should I put in this space? Should we should we get a, the piano? The new family piano object? And make, like, a little piano area? I think that's kind of nice, right? Um... It's not my wedding stories or high school years. Yeah, definitely not. I think that's kind of nice. It's a huge living room, but it still feels cozy. Okay, good. That's what I, that's what we're going for. Super bug with teens if they have any tooth mood while let while aging up. I'm sorry, what? I don't know if I'm aware of that bug you're talking about what's the what's the bug that sounds so specific you're loving the entire build so far oh thank you i think we can put a bookshelf back here we can teach kids piano we can do like a cute little circular rug over here maybe a window seat well i don't want the seat to block the window Maybe I do a little bit larger fuzzy rug. I hear either a wolf howling, how, howling outside or a child crying. I can't tell what it is. I have my window open right now. I think that this could be a good rug over here. Uh, if a child ages up to a teen and they have any of the tooth moodlets, they change outfits and appearance every time you leave the lot to Cass. Oh? Even if the moodlet goes away, they still, like, no matter 
how long it's been. What? Are you for real? Oh my god, so... I should delete all tooth moodlets before aging up my, my kids. Okay. Well... That would explain why I haven't run into that bug yet, because I haven't actually had a teenager age up yet. All all of my family is the oldest the oldest kid I have is this one right here. So we'll we'll have to keep our eye out for that. Thank you for telling me. Oh my gosh. I feel like this is just a nice little cozy family area right here. I really like that. I think that's nice. Um, I would like to get a little coffee table, I think. Or, sorry, a little side table. Is there any that came with this? Oh my god, there is! Oh! Oh my god, this is massive. Wow. They really said, Oh, we heard that you thought our side tables were huge. Let's give you this clonker. <laughs> Do you see this? They were like, Yeah, and? <laughs> Your points? Maybe I'll put this one here and then this one here. I feel like that's kind of nice. Hi, Blair. How are you? You like the sheep stool? I know. Isn't it so stinking cute? I'm kind of obsessed with it. I don't know if I'm liking the gold, though. I might change those to be like silver. There we go. Side tables are supposed to be huge. The Sims team probably. <laughs> I want Aster for Eric because he was your first infant. Precious memories of the froggy boy. Now we'll have to see what happens. I feel like normally I let chat vote, but I'll have to decide if I'm going to let chat vote. Because if anything, this is a dictatorship. And Shella always gets what Shella wants. That blocks the TV, but it's cute. The TV is huge. Yeah, it is. We earned it. Snowy escape side tables for the win. Yeah, those ones are really good. I will not disagree with you there. All right. Dictatorship with votes sometimes. Yeah. You can let us vote, but then you have the final say. I feel like that would not make sense. I don't know. Oh my god, Bree, you're getting silenced by the bot. I'll give it like two seconds to see if it will repeat itself. I swear, every time I read your alert out loud, then it plays like two seconds later. Is it not going to do it this time? Interesting. Sophisticated. I get it. Ha ha ha. This house is so cozy. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you like it because I'm really liking it so far, too. It's giving me good vibes. I like the side tables. Thank you. Okay. Did we get any new lamps? Any? Oh. Okay, sure. Yeah, we'll, we'll use that. That's fine. I'll use that. We also have this new lamp. And these are more like rec center lights, I feel like. Um, but I definitely, I think that's kind of nice. You can put that in the middle here. The bot said no more dad jokes. Yeah, the bot really was like, Brie, you're done. We're done with your jokes. Yeah, they're funky. That's a good word for them. I, I really like them, too. Okay, um, front entryway right here. I also kind of want to put, like, a table behind the couch. I don't know if y'all know what I'm talking about, but something like this, maybe? Just kind of help the flow of the room a little bit. You know what I mean? There are new plants, too. 
Yeah, I saw that there were new plants. Like, I really like this plant, but I don't like that it's together. It makes me so upset. Like, why would they do that? I wish they would separate it. Oh, this could be a cute little plant corner. Check it out. It's kind of fun. Big fish tank in the entryway. You know what? You are really smart. I love having fish tanks in my family homes. Let's do it. Yeah, the little fairy house. Isn't it cute? I think we also, isn't this the family that has the electric eel that I want to put in a fish tank? I think so. I'm pretty sure. Yes, okay. Well, our electric eel will have a home now. Yeah, that's right. I found, we found the electric eel while dumpster diving and I was like, this is going to be our new legacy fish. Get a little blue in the entryway here. I feel like I want another one of these lights over here, maybe. In the entryway. Oh, I see what's happening. Oh, I see what's happening here. There we go. Just delete that. Okay. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Yeah, you can put actual fish in the fish tank. It's really fun. Um, I feel like we need some kind of, oh, we got new stools. I want to put a little like place to sit and take your shoes off. Maybe something small, something comfortable, maybe something like right here. I feel like that's nice, right? Yeah. Um, also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Am I an interior designer? No, this is my full time job <laughs> streaming on Twitch, but I'm glad that you like it. I love building houses in The Sims and I try to make the house make sense for the most part, like the flow of it all. This is me paying you to name it Butthole Supreme Junior. No, we're not naming the fish Butthole Supreme Junior. We gotta... We gotta let Butthole go. We gotta think of a new name. Oh, these are fun. Butthole is of the past. Why do you hate me? Do you have any eel name ideas? I don't know yet. I feel like maybe I won't name it until, until we know. You know? Like maybe, maybe he just won't get a name until, until we know. Cause I don't think we really have any uh, memes yet. I feel like maybe I'll just put up family photos here, actually. There we go. We have a petal with the kids on either side. I think that's really cute. I heard memes. What about memes? Oh, nothing about memes. Don't worry. Nothing to see here. Don't worry about it. Maybe I'll put this because this is our family photo. Put that right there. And then we'll make a little gallery wall in here too. Those are all the photos that I had. I like that. I think that's really nice. Um, this is going to be the kids play area. 
What do you think so far, chat? Are we doing it? Is this a good house? I think it's it's doing really well for us. Oh, you know what I should do? I should get a clutter item. We have this Life's a Ball speaker. That's kind of fun. I don't know where to put it, though. Maybe in the office. Do I have a spot for it in the office? Not really. I have a spot for this speaker. Um, thanks for the follows, by the way. Welcome in, friends. Thank you. Can you show the outside quickly? Yeah! This is the, uh, the outside of the house. This is for my Sims and Bloom family. So, I'm- we have basically unlimited money. Because I won the lottery. <laughs> uh, so I'm just gonna finish this house right now. Um, but yeah, I- I really like it so far. I think it's really nice. Oh, I think it's really nice. So, hopefully you all like it too. Here we go. It's so pretty. Oh, thanks. I'll upload it to the gallery when we're done with it. Oh my god. We might have to build this for two streams, you guys. Because I'm not even done with the first floor yet. And we still have the entire second floor. And the entire outside. Do you think it'd be really weird to have two building episodes in a row? I don't know. Because I don't want people to be bored. But I also want to make sure we give this all of the attention it needs. Oh, there's a new fireplace too. Dang it, I maybe I can put this upstairs. Maybe. I'll think about it. No, not weird. Okay, yeah, then we'll definitely have to fill the finish the build tomorrow, but... I'm going to keep working on it. I'll go for a little bit longer. But yeah, if y'all are new here, first of all, welcome. And second of all, this is a good time to join my stream because um, we just started the Sims in Bloom challenge. And this is like us officially building their house. And so far, all of the episodes are uploaded over on my YouTube channel. So if you want to catch up, well, okay, episode two isn't up yet, but... Episode 1, parts 1 and 2 are up. And um, I'll be uploading the whole thing to YouTube. So feel free to catch up. And then you'll be able to like know what's going on. Um, yeah, it's the Sims in Bloom challenge. I'm new. What's your stream schedule? I stream every day except for Thursdays and Fridays. So... I'll be live every day until Wednesday. And Wednesday will be the last day of my work week. Pretty good. Um, I'm looking for a clutter item. Put here. I'm thinking this. There it is. Oh, that's the one item I was looking for. I think I feel like this item is really cute to put at the center of a coffee table. Um, what's the Sims in Bloom challenge? We actually have a link to it <laughs> in the chat if you want to read the rules. Uh, find it in the Discord. Yeah, we also have a Discord channel for it if you all would like to join my Discord. What's my YouTube? My YouTube name is Rochella. I'm basically Rochella on everything, so if you're ever wondering if I'm on a certain website, if you just look up Rochella, you'll find me. Also, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Um, how are we doing today? We're doing good. When will we play Among Us again? Uh, I think the date we're going to play Among Us again is going to be on the 31st. So, still got a lot of time. It just worked out for us this month that we had the most availability then. Sorry about that. <laughs> it's going to be a hot minute. I just wanted to say your hair is super pretty. Oh, thank you. What the heck? You're very sweet. Thank you for the compliment. Oh my god, you know what would make this house realistic? Light switches. Light switches. 
I'm getting distracted. <laughs> Whoopsies, nothing new. Another one over here. Thank you. Okay, light switches. Light switches. Can't wait for this to be uploaded. Yeah, so tomorrow I'm uploading the next 100 infants challenge episode. And then here's the thing. I have so many Let's Plays going on. So I have to decide if I want to upload the next Sims and Bloom stuff or if I want to upload Not So Berry. So we'll we'll have to see what I decide to upload on Monday, I guess. Um, it'll be a little surprise. <laughs> Because I'm not sure which one. Because it will be easier for me to upload Sims in Bloom. Because I don't really edit it that much. But if I want to upload the Not So Berry episode, then I'm going to have to spend a lot of time tomorrow editing. So we'll see if I have the energy for that. So. Leave random toys on the floor. Oh yeah, for sure. Usually, so usually how I build is I go through and I like place items that I feel like are very important like we can't live without them items to kind of like block out the room if you will and then I go back and I add lots of clutter so kind of like this kitchen you could look at this and be like that's a finished kitchen but I most certainly will be going back in here and adding more stuff I feel like this room is pretty good but you never know I could find items be like oh this would go good in this room so we'll kind of just be bopping around everywhere. But I think at this point, the living room is like mostly done. Um, but I do agree that we should go back in here and probably add some items. Like kid stuff. Hmm, I was just looking to see how that looked. Um, also, I'm kind of digging the white walls. I didn't know if I was going to keep them like that. But I might. Um, okay, should we do the kids' playroom area now? This is kind of the area that I had blocked off thinking of like, oh, we could let the kids play in here. What do you say? Kitchen clutter is your favorite? Nice. Okay. You're starting a rags to riches with knitting? That sounds so fun! Um, could you upload one part of this building for the legacy and take a break to upload other legacies between the second build stream? Well, I still need to upload episode 2, Silicons, which was not a building stream. This is episode 3. So, um, I don't know. I'll figure it out. We'll figure it out together. Yeah, I, I have like a backlog of videos right now <laughs> is the problem. Okay, I think I should put this right here. What do you guys think? I feel like this could be good for like when the family is hanging out together in the living room. We got a little tummy time going on so the baby doesn't feel left out. No, I won't ignore you. I appreciate you trying to help. It is very helpful. I just, it's a lot. There's much to think about. Um, we can use this heirloom box. That's kind of fun. I like the trains. Okay. Um, what else do I should I put in a kid's playroom area? Maybe one of these rugs. So that <laughs> We can lay the infant down. I'm also wondering if we want to add like a carpet in here, like an actual rug. Yeah, maybe I should do that first. I don't know if I want to change the flooring or not. I don't think so. These are good sized up too. Oh, you're right. They aren't that bad. That's good to know. Pillows are a poof. Yeah, and I'm also thinking like maybe some kid items. Like potentially... We could put a little whalebert slide. <laughs> I feel like maybe I'll save that for outside though. Because look at how big this thing is. Like, oh my god. 
Are you kidding me? Should we do a changing table down here? I feel like maybe that makes sense so that way they don't have to carry the baby all the way upstairs. Perhaps. Oh my gosh, happy birthday, fairy. Are you doing anything exciting? Anything fun? Yeah, I feel like this changing table makes a lot of sense. Uh, and then I wanted to add in like skill item I had this cardboard box thing which I think is kind of fun should I do that up against the wall like this maybe so our kid can draw and I'm trying to think of other toys that we would play with down here I was thinking maybe a dollhouse but that might be a little too big. Do you think this would still work if I went like this? I feel like it might still work, right? Um, I put the changing table in the bathroom. Oh, in the downstairs bathroom, you think? I don't know. I kind of like it being out here. Um, You got birthday freebies? Oh, I love that. I love that. Well, happy birthday. Then we have our toy chest over here. I have like toys kind of scattered around. And then I'm thinking like maybe a Blurfy in the corner. And that's probably enough. Diaper clutter on the ground. Um, I don't know if I want to, like, purposefully put clutter on the ground. Can you even put diapers on the ground? Honest question. Is there, like, an item? Imagine the smell bothering everyone in the living room watching TV. But it's The Sims, so who cares? Yeah. I don't know. We could put it down here in in the bathroom. You might be you might be onto something. I didn't consider that. That also frees up some more space for something else. Ooh, the kids' tent is so freaking big. I wish it was a little smaller. <laughs> what else could we put over here then? For everyone to play with. Maybe like the the doctor set. We could also size this up to full size then. There we go. I think that's good. Yeah, I know I can size the tent down, but I've found that I don't like doing that. Just a personal preference. I could also move this gate over to here and have the dollhouse be here and Blurfy be here. We have Boohoo Doctor blocks, a couple of kids' toys. I feel like that's kind of nice, right? Kids of all ages can enjoy this space. We can put all of their art up on the wall here. That's actually kind of cute, right? I feel like maybe there are some items we could put up there, like, initially, too. Um, are they wall items, maybe? Yeah, like this. Look at how cute that is! The playmat? Oh, I actually, I put the playmat over here. I was thinking that they would probably have their infant really close if they're letting their infant do tummy time like that. That's at least what went through my head. I think that's adorable. And then we can make our own crafts and like keep adding on to this wall here. We could even do like a little... I actually really like the... The owl tree. I 
think that's really pretty. I think that's really cute. Um, okay, let's find some curtains for these windows. Um, there's so much good build by. Yeah, I'm like obsessed with the the build by. There's so much good build by. What if I just did like that? I feel like that's neutral enough to where it doesn't feel like out of place. Maybe, maybe blue instead. I think that's nice. I like that. I feel like the other curtains that came with the pack probably are a little too big to fit. Could do those ones, but I don't know. I don't mind. I can't wait for this house. It's so good. Oh, thank you. You're making me blush. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to finish this house like in two streams because there's no freaking way I'm going to finish it here. All right, let's do a little runner. I can't say runner without saying it as if I'm calling for a runner. Here we go. I think that's nice. I like it. And I feel like maybe we would have a table here. Or a bookshelf. Hmm. I have a bookshelf over there, though. So, perhaps, perhaps we do a table bookshelf. Ah, oh, didn't see that coming, did ya? But I figure, like, the older kids that can read would probably, like, want to get a book, maybe, and read over here. I might even put, like, a comfortable chair. Someone did mention, like, pillows and stuff. I don't know if they'll fit in here now, but... If I move this to the middle of the room, you could do like a little stack of pillows and I think that's really cute. There we go. Uh, I'm glad I could catch a good portion of your stream. Life be busy sometimes. Yeah, I know. I'm always so sad when people are busy in life, but I totally understand. I'm just glad that I get to see you all when you manage to have a moment to pop in. It always makes me really happy. So thanks for doing that. Hmm. What kind of chair would be here? Maybe just like this. I think that's kind of nice. A plant maybe. Probably could fit a plant over here, but I might see if I can sneak in a little side table moment. This would be a good place to read kid books, too. It looks like a grandma's chair. How do I free rotate like that? Oh, you just hold the alt key. Also, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. I just started The Sims in Bloom and I'm about to have my first baby. No way. That's so exciting. Put a plant in the corner. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to put a plant like right here, actually. On top of the table. A little smiley face plant. What do you think? Yeah, I really like the new side table, too. I think that this is a really good one. I like that. Yeah. Is The Sims in Bloom a challenge? It is. Yeah, it's the one that I'm playing right now. I'm building this for my Sims in Bloom family. You can see them. They're all out here. Um, they're like, hello, it's so late at night. Why are we moving? Um, and my Sim is currently pregnant. So we're building for these two who are going to get married. They're two boys who are going to be living in these two bedrooms. And then this bedroom we're going to make into a nursery for our unborn child. Hopefully it's only one. Um, but yeah, that's what we're working on this house today. Oh, it's a lot. We're not going to finish it today. We're going to have to finish it tomorrow. Okay. Chat. Bathrooms or guest room? 
next? Bathrooms or guest room? You decide. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. I forgot how cute Petal is. I know. She's adorable, isn't she? Okay, everyone's saying guest room mostly, so... Okay, guest room will be easy because we're just going to do a generic bed. Just a nice, simple, not too crazy, elegant bed. Um, like that. And can I squeeze in a side table here? I think I can. Boom. If I turn it. If you turn your head just right. There we go. Oh no, I'm sorry that happened to you, Nixie. That's really annoying. Having game bugs like that. I'm sorry. Hmm. I'm back. What are we building? Uh, we're building a home for my family. Specifically the guest room right now. I'm trying to decide if they would have like wallpaper in there. I don't really think they would. Yeah, I think it might just be white wall. There we go. We have no budget, so I'll use the expensive wall. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. MVP side table, right? It's so good. It fits everything. Here we go. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Uh, link to the challenge exclamation point SIB, I think. Sims in Bloom should give you the link, hopefully. Okay, I kind of like doing this green as an accent color. I don't know though. That clips, but I think we're going to have to get over that because there's nothing else we can do. All right, uh, dresser. We do have this new dresser, which I think fits this space really nicely and also makes sense if you're a guest staying in this space to not have that big of a, of a wardrobe going on. And then I suppose we could do like a standing mirror situation something like that maybe how's my day been it's been really good thanks for asking i hope you've had a good day too might start with this one you should yeah we have a a discord channel specifically for the sims in bloom so if you ever want to share your challenge with anyone feel free to share it in the in the discord a lot of people have been sharing their families in there and I've been watching the whole time. It's been really entertaining. So thank you. Thank you, friends. Oh, I think that's cozy. That's really nice. Okay, and then I feel like the circular rug would be really good in this room. This one, maybe. It's a nice, big, fuzzy, fuzzy rug. There's a new standing mirror that's really cute. Is there really? I thought I looked and I didn't see one. Oh! Well, wouldn't you know? There's actually... Oh, that's terrifying. That's actually really nice. Yeah. Let me just... uh Put that, like, right there, maybe. Thanks for telling me. I guess I just didn't notice it. I love to see how much the bills on this will be. Oh God, yeah, you know, that's something I did not think about. 
when building this. So we're going to find out and we're going to find out together if we can afford this house when the bills come out. Let me tell you, we'll find out real quick what we're in for. Oh my God, this is precious. I actually like it being see-through. I think that's a nice light to have. I like it. Maybe we can put one like over here too. Vintage sconce. I like that. It's a good one. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you guys. I can't believe how little of this I've actually built. We're in danger. We're in grave danger. Block. I want to do like something. Oh, this is really ugly. I was hoping there'd be like a cuter clock. Maybe this one. That's good. I like that. There we go. Oh my gosh. Thanks for the follows, everyone. Welcome in. Might want to get some Birds of Paradise at the Romance Festival to cover the cost. Yeah, we're probably going to have to do that. Because I do have some plants, but definitely not enough for us to afford living here at the moment. Does this fit the vibes? Is this, is this cool or is this weird? I feel like that's kind of fun. What's the house value so far? Um, it says 30,000 simoleons. But I don't know if I believe that. Yeah, no, it's glitched. <laughs> I was about to say that is this house is definitely way more than that. Um, thanks for the follows, by the way. Welcome in. Oh my gosh, so many new friends. Welcome to our Sims in Bloom series, where I am currently building a house for our Sims and Bloom family. Great time to join us. Perfect time, actually. Very perfect. Impeccable timing, actually. Do I want to put this up here? Do I like the mirror? I feel like this mirror kind of works. I never use that mirror, but I'm going to use it there. I'm obsessed with this house. Really? Oh, thank you. Do you think I should turn the side tables to gold if I make this clock gold? Are we going gold? It will warm up the space. Warming? It's going to warm up the space, y'all. I think that might look better. Okay. Should I change this to gold then? Do we have gold for the safety barrier? No, that's going to have to stay just this color. That's fine. I like it. This house is so pretty. Oh, thank you. How many packs do you think you're going to use? Who knows? <laughs> I'm not limiting my packs here, so we can go crazy if we want to. You know what I mean? We can go crazy, girl. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go back to this kitchen really quick. Okay, I need to, um, figure out what wall I want to do here. Do I want to? I might do that. Is that too much? That might be too much. I don't really have a good, like, finishing point for this, though. Do I just do that wall, then? Or I guess I could do, like, a, a stone, kind of like a brick. And do the whole wall. That might be fine. But I think I can't go further than that.
Then maybe green is our color. Someone suggested it. I think it does warm it up really nicely. No, I don't like the green in there. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we need a rug. I like doing a little like rug in front of my kitchen, like the sink area. So let's pick one out. I think that one's nice. Add some color, maybe a cream color wall. I think I'm going to keep it white since we have these like brown wooden accents. Cause I, if I, I think if I would do cream, it might make it look a little too like poopy. <laughs> Sorry. That's the only word I can think of. Um, Ooh, that's actually nice. It's a good suggestion though. Hmm. Do I? Do I? Do I? Do I do a tiled kitchen? No, I don't think I do. I think we keep it wood floors. I think that's pretty good. I do want to add a couple of plants in here, though, because my sim is the first generation for the Sims in Bloom, so she really likes plants. So I feel like it only makes sense that we would have plants everywhere. Like, trying to grow stuff, maybe. Um, the lobster rug? Absolutely not. Over my dead body, you're going to have to kill me. Here we go. I think tomorrow, by the way, we're going to unlock a new merch tile, you guys. We're getting really close. Pops of yellow for Gen 1. You see, there is an issue with that. And the issue is that I hate the color yellow. So I'm being really brave, okay? I'm being so brave by doing this legacy challenge, but it hurts me. Yellow tile would be nice. No! In what economy would a yellow tile be nice? Not this one. Tomorrow? Yeah, I think tomorrow because uh, we're roughly 30 away, so it could be possible. Um, oh my god, I have cat fur in my nose. Are you going to do a Fall Guy stream soon? Uh, I don't currently have any plans to do a Fall Guy stream soon, but you never know. You never know what the cards hold. I would argue the gold accents count as yellow. Thank you. Thank you, Fickle. Oh my god, you're my hero. You're my hero. Thank you. You want me to talk in my silly little British accent for the rest of the stream? I think you might be the only person who wants that. I feel like everyone else would be like, oh my god, shut up, Miss Girl, please. <laughs> They'd be like, I can't watch this girl anymore. I have to go. Oh my god! We can put puzzles in here! Wait, this is the best day of my life! <gasps> Puzzle shelf! Puzzle shelf! Where should the board games go? Oh my god. Does it slot? Is that a slot right there? No, there's no way that's a slot. I'm gonna put the board games like on the floor then. Next to it. That's fun! Yes, thank you. Please, not the accent. It's kind of Australian. Clear! Or nor clear the condensation. And scene. How did I do? We could get this bracelet kit, too, for our kids. Maybe later. What about a jigsaw table? Do I need a table for it? Like a specific table? For the jigsaw? I'm a great Emma. Emma! Oscar worthy? Thank you. What's the table? I want to... Uh, you know? Do I need the games The games table? This thingy? 
You're telling me that I need this table. Oh my god. Okay, wait. I don't have a spot for this now. This is a disaster. Or no. Okay, how about this? Picture this. Our kids grow up in the future. And we won't need all of this toddler stuff forever. So once we are done with toddlers, then we make this the game table area. We get rid of the, the fence and everything and kind of repurpose the space because it wouldn't make sense to have it anymore. I think that that makes the most sense to me. But you can't let me forget because if I know one thing about Shella, she forgets a lot of things because she sucks. So don't let her forget. I don't think I want to put it outside. Anyways. Do I like that? I don't even know if I like that or not. I guess that's fine. Hi, Rain. Welcome on in. Where am I from? Oh, I'm from America, Minnesota. Welcome. This is, oh, Angela, this is going to be our bedroom. So I don't want to put a family game table in the bedroom. I do have space here, though. So potentially, potentially in the hallway, potentially, potentially, potentially here. No, 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 you're good. You're good. How would you have known? Ah? Potentially with a capital B? Thoughts? Thoughts? I'm gonna need another shelf for my puzzles up there then. Because we're gonna be puzzling away. So let me get my, let me, let me, let me. Too tall. Should I? No. Eh. Which shelf? This one again? No, I don't want to do that one again. This one? No. This, does that? It's slots, but there's only one slot. I'm upset. Do I just do that? Does that look good? Be honest with me. Who is the cat? The cat's Olivia. Isn't she just the most perfect little baby angel? It's gonna let me slot two items there even though they overlap. That's a little interesting. I don't know how I feel about that. What if I put this one like under? Like that. Uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Thank you. You have a cat named Olivia? Or you have a cat named Olive? My cat's brother's name is Olive. Oliver. He ate her whiskers. When she was a baby. So... There's that information that you didn't ask for, but <laughs> I literally, when I adopted her from the shelter, she had no whiskers because her brother like chewed them all off. <laughs> so she really struggled learning how to drink water because they use their whiskers to like feel and she just didn't have any. So she would always get water up her nose. It's a tragedy, honestly. I feel bad for her. She got bullied. I'm crying. Yeah, sorry. Trigger warning. Emotional raw. <laughs> Sounds like something a sibling would do. Yeah, honestly. Honestly, I respect it. Emotional raw. <laughs> uh. Okay. There we go. Okay, hey, I should not be doing the upstairs right now, though. We have to do the downstairs chat. Are you trying? You are trying to distract me. 
Oh, I see what you're doing. It's not gonna work. Siblings gone wrong. Oh, I see what you're doing. Why is there a table here? Who put that there? That wasn't me. Oh, I've never sinned in my life. I'm perfect. Anyways. Little Dika, can you open your eyes? I already have a jigsaw table. Sorry, that was really mean. <laughs> Sorry. It's upstairs. <laughs> that's how that's how I want to respond to everyone all the time, but I never do. I feel like people would think I was being serious and I would hurt actual feelings, so I don't talk to people like that unless I really know them. <laughs> Um, cause honestly, if someone talked to me like that, I would cry, which is so valid. I would just burst into tears. We're besties. I know when you're joking. Okay, good. Oof. Oof. I'm in the clear with little Dika. I want to put the shower here. I think shower tub combo. Anyways, when the intrusive thoughts win. <laughs> Dun, dun, dun. Okay, we can put the baby changing table there, maybe. Right? Right? But then I need a sink and a toilet. There's no new toilet? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, this pack sucks. I can't believe they wouldn't give us a new toilet. Grumble, grumble, complain, grumble. I want 20,000 toilets. Right now. Anyways, thanks for the follows. Welcome in, friends. <laughs> Trash can for diapers. Ah, Carolina. That is where you are, a noob. Because we are going to be taking our diapers and feeding them into the dumpster. So we can go dumpster diving for riches. It's okay, though. Don't worry. It's not your fault. You didn't know. But I'm here to teach you. I'm here to show you the way. And you're so welcome for that insight. <laughs> I love that sink. I know this sink is my new best friend. I I actually don't have any friends. So let me clarify. This sink is my only friend. Um, I love her. We're besties now. So forgot about the dumpster. How could you forget about the dumpster? <gasps> a new hand towel? Oh my god. Uh, yes. Where have you been all my life? Uh, 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 where have you been? I like that. I'm sorry, Shella. My sims are rich, so I don't do poor people stuff. <sighs> You're talking to me? I won the lottery, okay? I know a thing or two about being rich in The Sims, Carolina. You hurt my feelings. <laughs> uh, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Olivia's getting so many scritches today. God. People are so insensitive. Okay, we have a baby changing table down here, which is very good. Very needed, I think. I feel like that slots nicely there. Um, thanks for the follows, friends. Welcome in. Thank you. Hello, I'm new and you play Planet Zoo. Let's go. I do play Planet Zoo. I usually do what I like to call Zoo's Day Tuesday, but the new Sims pack just dropped. So as far as I'm concerned, Zoo's Day Tuesday does not exist right now. Um, We'll see how long that lasts. Sorry, everyone. Sorry. Sorry, everyone. Emotional. I know. You can unsubscribe and leave. I get it. 
I would too. Personally offensive? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, I need diaper stuff. Here we go. Oh my god. Olivia, you gotta stop shedding, girly pop. Like, this is too much. I'm gonna... Scritches for Olivia? I'll do you one better. Brush time. It was a good girl. Hi. Careful. This is mommy's new sweater. If you rip it, I will rip you. You don't want brush time? Look at how much I got. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Can you... Come on. Scuba thing. Come here. Can I use this now? She is soaked in her own drool. That's nasty. I, I scratched her neck right here and it's just wet. Anyways, she does not want to be brushed on camera, I guess, so. Olivia, you nasty. Nasty little goober. Okay, where is the new soap? I would like to put it here. Your cat licks herself until she falls asleep? Yeah, no, that's valid and fair. My cat doesn't do that, though. She falls asleep and just drools, so... <laughs> There's that. Um, okay, well... I'm putting my whole samosi into this build, by the way. So... It's gonna be intense. I hope you're ready. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Why do I even want this color? I don't think so. It seems a bit pretentious. I'm sorry, not ready. Okay, I'm gonna put a rug in here and then... Probably call it good, and then we'll have to move to the next. What you call it, or bathroom? That's the word. I can't focus right now. I'm having a hard time. <laughs> Save? Oh, when's the last time I saved? Actually, I don't know. It's been a while. Okay, I'll save. I'm so ready for this build. I know, it's gonna be good. Okay, um, that bathroom is done. I suppose. Now we have to do this bathroom. So this is like the main downstairs family bathroom. Should I, I should put up, I should put a toddler potty in here actually, shouldn't I? If we're gonna have little tinkles going on we're gonna need to have a tinkler let's do that let's where's where's the where's the there it is um i am i'm in minnesota right now i'm not from minnesota i'm actually from texas but i left to follow some boy i guess Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Yeah, there's toilet rugs now. It's in the new um, bathroom stuff pack. Okay, we have a little toddler potty. Okay, uh, this one... I don't think we're going to be able to get a full tub in here. So let's do a little shower moment in the corner, perhaps. 
and then a little toilet and a sink and the bathroom mirror is growing together worth it well booty poppin king i'm glad you asked i think it is so does my cat she just meowed i don't know if you heard that she loves growing together <laughs> Honestly, I'm having a great time. I will disclose that I actually was given this code by the creator network, so I didn't purchase it myself, but I would have. Um, and I, I don't think it has, like, you know how usually when Sims packs comes out, they have a bunch of bugs and stuff? I feel like this one does not. I have not personally run into any game-breaking bugs. Chat has informed me of a few teenager-related game-breaking bugs, but... Olivia, what are you doing? But um, I haven't gotten to there yet, so. Um, I also just in general always recommend waiting for a sale to come along to purchase a pack. But if you cannot wait and you're like, this is the one pack I want to buy early, I would say go for it. Live your truth. Um, that's how I feel. There's a sale right now. I don't think there's a sale for the new pack right now. The new tile is so good. I know, I like it a lot. Yeah, there's a sale in general for Sims packs. That is so true. But not for the new one. So true, besties. So true. I'm gonna move the light switch to this side. Yeah, I'm glad Deli did that too. I didn't realize that she did. It's definitely a nice floor tile. All right. I think this looks pretty heckin' good so far. What do you guys think? This is what we've done so far with this house. I've been building all stream. And we did the entire outside. Which I really like. Uh, this is going to be a greenhouse. I haven't really worked on that yet. Uh, we did the entire outside, and we did the entire first floor for the most part. So tomorrow, during stream, I'm going to be continuing to work on this build. And finishing it, hopefully. Um, and uh, yeah, then hopefully we'll get to do some gameplay as well. I'm sorry if you came here hoping for Sims and Bloom gameplay, but that is just not in the cards for us right now. Because my Sims are homeless. So yeah. It's really good though. I, I really like how this build is turning out. I'm having good vibes with it. Honestly, I could stream for like 10 more hours if I wanted to. But I, I don't think I should. <laughs> um, you've been building along and I love it so much. Oh, I love that. I love that. It's so pretty so far. Thank you. I think it's going to be the perfect size for our family. Here, I'll show you guys. If this is your first time here, this is our Sims in Bloom family. This is Petal, our founder. She's currently pregnant. Uh, and we have our oldest son, Aster. And then our younger son, Forrest. And then this is our boyfriend, uh, Everett. So they really deserve a nice family home. Uh, this is going to be Aster's bedroom. This is going to be Forrest's bedroom. This is going to be the nursery for our unborn child. This will be the parents' bedroom. Then we have two bathrooms up here as well. Then we need the greenhouse for Petal. And then I want to do a treehouse and a lot of backyard stuff. Like, we'll probably have a nice, like, I don't know, a nice vibe going on over here. Stream for 10 hours. I could, but I don't think I will. My mods are like, God, please no. Please no, Shella. We could get like a family pool if we wanted to. Food's not going to be ready for a little bit, so you got time. I know. But I think this is a good stopping point. Because we finished the first floor. For the most part. Look at all of our family photos. 
Damn, he fine. I know, right? I like him. This whole series, by the way, is on my YouTube channel. And I also posted the... Uh, I also have a 100 baby challenge that we started. So uh, 100 infants challenge. So definitely check this out if you haven't seen it. And then we have Sims and Bloom episodes. This one I just posted today. Um, oh my god, I didn't even realize. We did it. We hit 13,000 subscribers on YouTube. That's crazy. Thank you all so much for subscribing. And thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Uh, 13k, that's unlucky. But you know what? I think that bodes well for our 100 infants challenge. I'm posting episode 2 of the 100 infants tomorrow. So get ready. Get ready. Uh, and then, yeah, people are asking when Not So Berry is going to come out. And I don't know. We'll have to see. <laughs> I have it recorded, don't worry. Um, but yeah, so feel free to subscribe over on YouTube for more content. Um, thank you for the sub, by the way, Strawberry and Sammy for 10 months. Welcome back. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, and also thanks for the follows here. So yeah, it's very exciting. Thank you, everyone. I'm happy about it. Um, but yeah, I have lots of Let's play. So if you like not so berry, you got Cur this one's a finished let's play. It's only 82 episodes long, so uh, good luck. <laughs> um, but yeah, feel free to subscribe over there for more, because I'll be uploading this. Yeah, it's only 82 episodes, and each episode is only like three to four hours long. Okay, you guys, just like watch it really quick. It's so easy. Um, thanks for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. Um, but yeah, we're going to continue building this house tomorrow. Um, I will be going live. You know, I might go live a little early tomorrow because... If I'm going to be honest with you, I think this might take like three more hours <laughs> for me to finish the house. So if we want to do any gameplay tomorrow, I might go live a little bit early. Uh, normally I go r live around 5 p.m. Eastern, but... Um, Feel free to join my Discord server because I will post when I'm going live there. Uh, also, if you follow me here, it should tell you when I go live, but sometimes it's a little delayed, so I don't know. You have better chances with Discord. It will like tell you like, oh, Shell is live, and then you'll look and I'll be live for like two hours and you'll be like, what? <laughs> um, But yeah, seeing Raven makes me miss Quinn. I know, I miss the, the Waldens a lot. Or the Lexton's. It's a nice house. Thank you. I know. So we're going to finish it tomorrow. I'll upload it to my gallery too. So you all can play in it as well. Um, I'm building it like specifically for my Sims though. So I apologize in advance. Because I'm going to be like personally cluttering it. Instead of just standard clutter. Um, but you know what? Sometimes that's fine. I usually follow Discord notifications as it's more accurate. Yeah. Definitely more accurate on Discord. Link to Discord is in the chat. Um, also, we can put links to all my socials in case you all would like to stalk me on every platform. Um, there are all those links. I'm very active on YouTube and Twitter and Instagram. So I love the butterfly clips. Thank you. I feel very cute today. This is my new sweater. You guys like it? It's like a, it's like color block. Color block pastel vibes. So yeah, that's all. Thanks for noticing. It's super cute. Thank you. Oh. Do you feel bonita? I feel bonita. Wonderful. Where did I get it? I got it off of this website called Cider. Um, I think it was roughly $30. So not like too bad for a sweater. And also it's good quality. So, um, so yeah. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Wonderful. <laughs> I knew it was from Cider. It's got the vibes. Hey, there you go. Kirsten knows. Kirsten knows. Um, but yeah, it's pretty good. I, I like the vibes. I recently found Cider and I've been using it more recently to buy sweaters and stuff. So God, you know, what? I just want to stream for like three more hours and finish this house right now. I have the Sims sickness. Okay, it's a problem, but I have to cut it off. I have to cut us off. I have to. <laughs> I just got here. I'm sorry. 
I'll be I'll be back tomorrow though. Okay, tomorrow I'll go live a little bit early. Okay. It'll be fun. It'll be Sunday fun day. Do it you won't. I will. Um give it another hour. No, I have to. I have to pee so bad. I have to pee. Um but yeah, come back tomorrow. We'll finish the build tomorrow. Um also, if you haven't watched the 100 baby challenge video yet, watch that. And get ready to comment your baby names on the second video that's coming out tomorrow. But yeah, I'm so sorry if you just joined the stream. Um, that is tragic. Be earlier next time. <laughs> just kidding. Um, oh, thanks, Taylor. Yeah. I Honestly, I have to make time for Overwatch tonight. I want to play Overwatch. so, uh, And I deserve it as a treat because I didn't really play that much over the past... On my days off, I, I did not take time off. I was editing, so I deserve it. I deserve to, to, to just have fun for a little bit because editing is not fun. Um, who's my main? Anna. I'm an Anna main. Um, but yeah, so I don't know. I could play Overwatch or I could edit the next Not So Berry episode. Guess we'll find out. Anyways, I'm going to go. Will I be live the same time tomorrow? Um, I think I'm going to go live a little early. Sometimes on Sundays, I like to go live a bit early. So normally I go live at 5 p.m. Eastern. But if you get the Discord notification, uh, you'll know. You'll know when I'm live early. Um, but yeah, we're going to go raid someone now. Oh my gosh. Thank you for hanging out with me. I feel a lot better. I feel like the COVID has left me and I am now free to be my true self, uh, which is still chronically ill, but not hacking and wheezing. So that's pretty nice. Um, we love that for her. Okay, let's, let's find someone to raid. Let's find someone to raid. Yeah, we're gonna raid someone, Olivia. I don't know what she wants. Definitely not to be in here right now. Um. Okay, so many people are playing The Sims. I love that. I love that for us. So many decisions. Um. Okay, you know what? My friend, uh, how long is he gonna be live? Okay, my friend Steven is live. Let's go, let's go raid Steven. I love Steven a lot. Um, also, what the heck? I didn't hear that alert threading fibers, but thank you for the 28 month resub. I really appreciate it. Thank you. All right, let's go raid Spring Sims. Tell him he smells yellow smellow. Love Shella. Okay, I'm ending stream. She's like, mother, please. I would like to go somewhere else. God, she's like, get off. Okay, well, I'm going to go. I'll see you all tomorrow, probably a little bit early because I'm in the mood to play The Sims a lot. So I'll see you then. Uh, take care of yourselves. Drink some water. Have a nice steaming poo and I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye for now. Thank you for watching my YouTube video. I don't know what I'm singing. This is my outro, but thanks. See you next time. Love you. Bye.